Muy buenas, en la parte anterior, Prin quiere escapar de su nuevo hogar para visitar a su amigo Tristán. Cuando lo encuentra y sin saber controlar sus nuevos poderes, lo mata. Así que debe hacer un ritual para revivirlo. Seguimos con la segunda parte de Prim titulada El Ritual Espiritual. Y recuerda, si te gusta el vídeo, dale a like. Y si te gusta el canal, suscríbete y dale a la campanita. Y si te interesan los juegos largos, suscríbete a mi canal secundario. Tienes los enlaces en la descripción. Parte 2. El Ritual Espiritual. So, this is it. The realm of the dead. In all its questionable glory. ¿Me puedo volver a entrar y recoger la carta? You should have asked my permission before giving her that abomination. Come on, brother. She, she really needed a friend. What she needs is my business, Kiris. Ugh, you sound just like father. Can I have that casketball card over there? Can you have it what? Can I have it, please? You can. Great! If you win it. What? Defeat me in a game of casketball cards, and it shall be yours. Have you collected at least eight cards? You need them for a competitive deck, you know. No, not yet. Do not fret. They can be found all across the realm. Come back when you have them. Bien, necesito al menos ocho cartas para jugar. Y para ganarme esta otra carta. So, this is what my prison looks like from the outside. El libro de los muertos. Ooh, let's see what Thanatos is reading here. I bet on the Encyclopedia of Disastrous Parenting Daughter Edition. Oh, it's the Book of the Dead. Very ominous. Featuring detailed descriptions of every known local species, this book will take you on a fascinating tour of the biodiversity of the underworld. Edición de patrocinadores. Incluye artículos en inglés y alemán. ¿No me lo vas a traducir? ¿En serio que no han traducido todo esto? Espera, espera, aquí. Esto sí está traducido. Cerbero. No tiene nada que ver con... Con el que vemos en las películas. Cerbero, el inamovible centinela del inframundo. Antaño guardián del reino de los muertos. Ahora es el devoto compañero de Hades y Perséfone. Un dato poco conocido sobre él. Siente predilección por el dulce sabor de las granadas. Mm. Bien, te gusta la granada. Aunque posee un aspecto imponente, Cerbero es una criatura fiel con una de dedicación inquebrantable, que vela por la seguridad del inframundo junto a sus amos divinos. Esto sí está traducido porque es importante, lo demás no. Mucho texto, ¿eh? Luciernaguías. Creo que los únicos importantes son los que están con marca página, ¿verdad? Sí. Son tres. Los que están con marca página. Eh, Luciernaguías. Conozca el reino de las Luciernaguías. Maravillosas criaturas imbuidas en un aura mística. Estos seres encantados se acoplan a objetos de gran re relevancia y emiten una luz hechizante. Estas maestras de la invisibilidad se mimetizan con el entorno y se mezclan con las sombras. Bueno, 
y el último sería el Fénix. ¿Qué nos hace falta? Una pluma de Fénix. El Fénix es un ave fascinante con un aura mística. Desde su humilde nacimiento como un polluelo con pelusilla, madura hasta convertirse en un deslumbrante adulto con plumas llamativas. Ah, está aquí. Va creciendo hasta convertirse en esto. Esta extraordinaria criatura que irradia sabiduría y resiliencia simboliza el poder transformador del renacimiento, ya que resurge de las cenizas de su muerte. Ya está. No creo que haya más. Pero han puesto un montón en inglés. Y han puesto un montón de criaturas, ¿eh? Ah, mira. Este no tiene... Eh, no tiene marca página. Ah, sí, es este. Esta es la última marca página. Castor Zombie. Conozca el terrorífico mundo del castor zombie, una horripilante criatura que acecha en las riberas de los ríos y en nuestras pesadillas. Esta abominación impía, una retorcida mezcla entre el castor y criatura no muerta, construye presas con un toque espeluznante. En vez de ramas y troncos utiliza restos de cadáveres humanos. Esto se puede quitar porque me está tapando el texto. Restos de cadáveres humanos y una grotesca muestra de su insaciable hambre. Eh, no sé lo que dice debajo. Se puede quitar. No sé lo que dice exactamente. Pero bueno, utiliza restos de cadáveres humanos para hacer las presas. Una grotesca muestra de insaciable hambre de carne humana, supongo que dirá. Bueno, a lo mejor nos sirve. Más adelante. ¿Lo ha guardado en algún sitio esto? Hola mamá, he metido la pata hasta el fondo. Cuando volví a casa, toqué a Tristán y creo que lo he matado. Me siento fatal. Pero ¿qué eres? Dice que hay un modo de resucitarlo. El método de Orfeo. Así que aún puedo arreglarlo. Cruza los dedos por mí, te echo de menos. Y lo que tengo que hacer es... Buscar los ingredientes para el método de Orfeo. Buscar el alma de Tristán. Encontrar el hilo de vida roto de Tristán. Encontrar una pluma de Fénix y conseguir la llave del laboratorio de Keres. Yet another of Thanatos' fruitless attempts at wildly guessing what teenagers are into. I've never tried it, but I could swear I heard the old man giving it a shot when he thought I was sleeping. I still hear it rattling in my ears, like a bouncing bag of bones. Me ha puesto una cama elástica. ¿Qué más? Pozo. La, a ver. Bueno, miro el pozo primero. Hay alguien dentro del pozo. ¿Es alguien down there singing? Hello. Hello. How is strange. Gallina zombie. I sense an overwhelming loneliness in her black, expressionless eyes. Aquí están las plantas. Eh, esta y estas son las plantas que recogimos antes. Una es para dormir y otro para para la música. Hay una polea. Hmm. Quizá necesite una, una cuerda. El mapa. Ya. La casa está aquí, el pozo. Aquí está la casa de las morias. De las moiras. ¿Qué más? Bosque prohibido. 
मैये Salgo de aquí. Ah, tengo que elegir el sitio donde quiero ir. En aquí había algo que ponía la cosa más cruel del mundo. Thanatos made sure que no podía escapar por mi ventana, que podría might have tried once o twice, by literally putting a bottomless pit under it. He calls it the abyss of reason. Pues a la casa de las Moiras. No sé si este será el orden. No, that's not it. Maybe like this. No. I like your music. Uh, I said I like your music. It's beautiful. What do you know? It's worthless. Sorry. I, I... forgive me. I, I didn't mean to be rude. It's okay. Rude is my middle name. The first one's Prim, by the way. Prim? So it is true. Thanatos brought his baby girl home. Hey, I'm not a baby. You were the last time we heard about you. Sorry about your mother. Thank you. But it's good to have you here now. I'm Echo. No te lo tomes a mal, pero ¿por qué eres mi tagallina? Eres consciente de que tienes un agujero en el pecho, ¿no? Please don't get me wrong, but why are you half chicken? Chicken? Pardon moi, Miss Reaper. I am a siren. But aren't sirens like mermaids? A common misconception. We are bird people. Oh. Interesting. Si eres una sirena, no deberías estar hechizando marineros para matarlos o algo así. If you're a siren, shouldn't you be luring sailors to their death or something? Well, I guess I'm just not cut out for the whole evil seducer thing. I mean, I can't even convince anyone to change their mind with my music. Eres consciente de que tienes un agujero en el pecho, ¿no? You know you have a hole in your chest, right? Of course. But where is your... My heart, the very seat of my being, the pulsing center of my essence, has been severed from my breast and tenderly bestowed upon the object of my affection. Um... I cut it out myself, okay? And gave it to Lucky Love Three as a token of my eternal admiration. You what? Don't you think that's a little dramatic? You can never be too dramatic where love is concerned, Prim. Emotions demand drama. They are drama. And who is this Lucky Love? Three. Her name is Lucky Love Three, or at least that's the name of her avatar in Game of Gnomes Online. I later found out that her real name is Lachesis. And she lives in that house over there. Es una de las tres parcas. O Moira. ¿Y qué haces aquí tocando canciones tristes? Ve a ver a la quesis. So why are you here playing these sad songs? Go inside and see la quesis. If only it were that easy. It is. Just a few steps and you're... You don't understand. It's her sisters. Lackey is a Moira, you know. A fate. And the three of them are... pretty close. The first time I went to visit Lackey Love Three, I... I was nervous. Her sisters woke from their sleep and I, I just started saying all these stupid, stupid things. I have a tendency to babble and spew all kinds of nonsense when I get nervous, you know. So I thought if I gave her my heart, that might help soften theirs. But no. Well, that sounds bad. So what's the plan? 
<laughs> there must be a way to win them over. Well, as you can see, I'm trying to go with the obvious choice. As a siren, I should be able to make people change their minds with my music. I just don't know what to sing about. Hmm. Well, I can't speak for anybody else, but if I were Lackey Sisters, I'd be impressed to see you trying to get to know the family. I'm desperate. I'll try anything. So, what do you know about them? Um, I think they all have a favorite place. I mean, who doesn't have a favorite place, right? Sure, why not? What are their favorite places? I have no idea. Oh. And they, they own a tavern, right? So they probably have favorite drinks. It might also be useful to know about their energies. I mean, the way to the heart is through the stomach, right? If you don't cut it out, that is. That's not helping, Ms. Reaper. And they have pets. But I don't know whose pet is whose. Places, drinks, allergies, and pets. You know what? I'll see what I can find out for you, and then you can sing about it for them. <laughs> Your song will be super compelling. You do that? Oh, thank you. Let me know when you're ready to help me compose it. Bien, esta será la manera de conseguir la llave del laboratorio. ¿Cómo averiguo las mascotas de las Moiras? Ay, no, pistas no. No lo leí. Lo quité rápido. O sea, no he leído nada. ¿Esta es una carta? Sí. Debería haber una manera en el menú de desactivar las pistas, que no te den pistas, pero no, no lo hay, yo he estado buscando. No creo que esto importe. present and future come together in a cozy atmosphere. Treat yourself to a drink at the Misty Moira. It's your destiny. Oh. Ah, se lleva el cubo. Just great! It's empty and it's full of holes. It's full of white paint. I never understood why people put these in their yards. I'm gonna rid the yard of the sight of this creature, just because I can. Bueno, tengo un cubo con agujeros y un gnomo de jardín. Ghosts operating heavy equipment. Boo where? Hmm, looks like something's under construction. I wonder what it'll be when it's finished. The Misty Moira Tavern. No vacancy. Morning. Construction site is haunted. But only Monday till Thursday during working hours. Oh, I didn't know they played chess in the Realm of the Dead. <sighs> Finally, something I recognize. Chess? What an absurd game. No, 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 no. This is the official 14 by 14 inch game of Gnome's Game Board, 3rd edition. I'm still saving up for the special collector's version with the colors of the squares inverted. Uh-huh. Aw, oh, what a cute little fellow. Pardonne-moi! This is an official game of Gnome's Gnome, and he's neither cute nor little. He's just about right, with his white hat and his pug nose. Este gnomo no lo puedo usar aquí. Hmm. I see no reason why I should do that. ¿Y sustituir un gnomo por otro? No. No, tampoco. What are all these chords for? Isn't it obvious I play Game of Gnomes online? My game board is connected to the one in the Fates Garden, so if I place a gnome here, it appears over there as well. Only much bigger. Oh, 
único que me queda es llamar a la puerta. O entrar directamente. A ver, que se calle ya. Hey, he tried to bite me. Es con el cubo. There must be a better way to silence him. There must. No sé. Puede que haya algo, un corcho. Le va a poner un corcho en la boca. Quiet as the grave. Ah, much better. May the universe reward you for your bravery, my child. Do you mind if I take it? Feel free as a bird, darling. I never liked him much anyway. Se lleva la cabeza. Before he was turned into a shrunken head, he used to be a famous singer or something like that. But those days are long gone. Now he's only known for this constant horrible screaming. Namaste, young soul. Namas what? Yeah, exactly. Challenge the norms and find your own truth. You go, girl. I'm afraid this is going to be the weird kind of conversation. Who are you? Oh, I have many names. I'm the Alotta, the present, the here and now. I'm a Moira, a daughter, a lover, and first and foremost, a sister. I'm Lachesis, but my friends call me Lucky. So, everybody calls you Lachesis? <gasps> You're a bit of a firecracker. <laughs> I like that. And the resemblance is undeniable. It's clear as night you're his daughter. A chip off the old block. What? I look exactly like my mother. If you say so, Princess of Death. I prefer Prim, if you don't mind. Prim it is, then. My sisters and I welcome you. Vengo de parte de Keres. Necesita acceso al laboratorio. Le va a decir que no. Kiri sent me. She needs access to her lab. As much as I'd love to help you there, sweetie, I'm afraid this door will stay shut. Sorry. We gave your aunt plenty of reminders, but she still forgot the rent anyway. Eh, no sabrá dónde se guardan los hilos de la vida que están cortados, ¿no? You don't happen to know where the cut life threads are stored, do you? Not a clue, little bird. You should ask Atropos, my older sister. She's the one who cuts them. So, she must dispose of them afterward, I guess. Okay. Where can I find her? Oh, she's asleep. Just like my other sister, Clotho. Upstairs? No. So, where are they? Right here. You just need to wake them up. That's an odd thing to say. Es una Moira. What's a Moira? We're the goddesses of fate, Prim. All three of us. We spin, measure, and finally cut the human's life threads. And what's your job? I'm the allotter. I take the measurements. Oh, then you must have... Oh, sweetheart. Yes, I measured out your mother's life thread too. Poor thing. I'm sorry, love. Did... um... Did you decide how long it would be? No. No! We don't decide anything. Fate does. And we're just Fate's humble servants. It's executive committee, if you will. You must miss her terribly. Can we change the subject, please? Sure. Hay un montón de preguntas. 
¿Qué clase de sitio es este? ¿Qué kind of place is this? You're in the Misty Moira, the underworld's only guest house. <laughs> Except for that shabby old drinking hole in Asphodel Meadows. Rumor has it that minotaur droppings were found in their kitchen. Unfortunately, I regret to inform you that not only is our only room taken, it has also been declared a prohibited area. Anyway, we're currently preparing a major new attraction outside. Trust me, if all goes as planned, the Five Skull ratings are going to be flooding in. Creo que tienes un admirador no tan secreto. I think you have a not so secret admirer. Oh, you've met Echo? Isn't he cute? Wait, is that his? His heart. He gifted it to me as a token of his affection. I still don't see how self mutilation is romantic. You will someday, sunshine. Ah, oh, the roller coaster ride that is forbidden love. Oh yeah, your sisters don't like him, do they? No, dear. They don't approve of our relationship. And since us girls are so close, it makes things rather difficult. That must be hard. Oh, you have no idea. What if I helped Echo convince your sisters you two are made for each other? Would you give me the key to my aunt's lap then? Let me tell you, if you did that, love, I'd bend and break every rule in the world for you. Just don't tell your father, okay? It seems quite important to him that we teach your aunt a lesson about her constant forgetfulness. No problem. I'm an expert in not telling him things. Eh... Lucky, ¿puedes contarme algo sobre ti o tus hermanas? Lucky, can you tell me anything about you or your sisters? Like, what's your favorite? Sorry, darling. I'm trying to distance myself from all forms of self-presentation and instead fully embrace becoming one with the universe. Plus, I really don't want to talk badly about other people. So I prefer to say nothing about my sisters. Except for this, they are heartless monsters that want to destroy my life and ruin everything I've ever dreamed of. Also, they constantly make fun of my spelling. Okay. Lo de la ortografía tiene que ser importante porque lo repito otra vez. ¿Qué decía de tu ortografía? What was that about your spelling? Clotho and Atropos always mock me because of it. Okay, I might make tiny orthographic mistakes once or twice per word. But who doesn't, right? You were right. Your sisters are monsters. Tiene que ser importante eso. I think I need it elsewhere. See you later, Lackey. May your journey be filled with love and light. This little fellow has the loudest voice I've ever heard. But he's quiet now, thanks to the cork I gave him. He likes that cork so much, I can't even pull it out with my hands anymore. El corazón. No creo que me lo deje llevar. Hilo de la vida. For us humans, these threads determine how long we get to be alive. And here, they just lie around on a makeshift bar. The afterlife is strange. None of them looks torn or broken. Tristan's must be somewhere else. It's the drink menu. The heading says, your hostess's picks. These must be the fate's favorite drinks. Each of them wrote something down here. Hmm. But it doesn't say whose favorites they are. Let's see. The first drink on the menu is a gartini, which seems to be short for garlic martini. 
Ugh. There are also instructions how to make that cocktail, but they're full of spelling mistakes and mm, ya sabemos de quién es ese. Next one is Ivy Punch, and somebody wrote also for my fish Schrodinger under it. The menus rounded off with root beer without exclamation point Ivy. <laughs> Significa esto. No quiero pistas. Ah, bueno, no me está saliendo nada, ¿no? Ah, ya entiendo. No es que te dé. De... A ver, ¿se puede quitar de alguna manera? No, no se puede quitar. Ah, sí. No es que te dé pistas como yo pensaba. Es que a medida que vas descubriendo las pistas en el juego, te las va escribiendo aquí. Eh, ¿Cómo averiguo las bebidas preferidas de las Moiras? Ya sabemos... A ver... Pero no lo he escrito. No he escrito nada. ¿Por qué? Se supone que ya tenemos una pista. It's the drink menu. These ver. must be the first drink on the menu. Mira, a veces guarda algo. Martini, which El ajitini for garlic martini. Martini de ajo. Also instructions. Vale, está lleno de falta de ortografía. O sea, aquí parece que se guarda algo, pero al final lo lees y no se guarda nada. No sé cómo... Bueno, sabemos que el martini de ajo es de la que sí, que está lleno de falta de ortografía. Pero... Eso de que me va a servir como una llave. Remember our deal, darling. Ah. You get me a date with Echo. I'll look the other way while you snatch that key. Es la llave del laboratorio, que será ah no, fuera del jardín. Pensaba que sería esta puerta, pero no. Es esta puerta. A ver, a lo mejor preguntándole. Welcome back, Sunflower. No. I think I need it elsewhere. See you later, Lackey. May your journey be filled with love and light. No sé qué tiene que ver. Cuando leo el menú y aparecen los iconos aquí. It's the drink. These must be the fates. The first drink. Ahí está, aparece algo ahí. A gartini, which seems to be short for their... Como si actualizara algo, pero... No sé qué actualiza. People down here really have a strange taste in interior decoration. Y antes parecía que, apare que actualizaba el el mapa. Pero no, no ha actualizado nada. Ah, mira, volver. Así se vuelve. Haz cosquillas a la reina luciérnaga para que te ayude. Ah, pues sí, es así entonces. No se, no se actualiza cuando yo descubro algo. Se actualiza si pico en, en la reina de las luciérnagas y se... Me da pistas. Entonces puedo, no tengo por qué usar las pistas obligatoriamente.
pero... ¿Puedo subir o intentar ir por el jardín? It's locked. Cerrado. ¿Y se actualiza algo? Como entro en el jardín de las Moiras. Voy a subir. Had to vacuum um cat hair all morning. Still sneezing. Bien, lleno de falta de ortografía otra vez. Eh, ella, la que sí tiene un gato. Entonces, de aquí, ¿cómo averiguo las mascotas de las Moiras? Sé que la Kessis tiene un gato y que su bebida favorita es el martini de ajo. Had to vacuum um cat hair all morning. Still sneezing. No, 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 no creo que ella tenga un gato. Ella tiene alergia a los gatos. Dudo mucho que si ella tiene alergia a los gatos tenga un gato así que me imagino que el gato será de sus hermanas de una de sus hermanas I find your fishy quiet confusing it's surely only practicing its backstroke right pero no se actualiza en ningún sitio eh No sé. Despertador cinta métrica. Three very weird alarm clocks. One has scissors for hands. Another one resembles a spinning wheel, I guess. And the last one is that measuring tape? Hmm. I'll take them all. If I'm going to commit burglary, I'll do it right. Me lleva todos los relojes, todos los despertadores. La cinta métrica es de la que sí, que ella dijo que ella medía todos los hilos de vida. El que corta es de la hermana mayor, es la que se encarga de cortar los hilos. Y el de la rueca será de la hermana, no sé si mediana o menor. Medicina para la alergia. Inside the drawer, there are anti-allergy sprays with garlic cloves printed on them. Inside the drawer, there are anti-allergy sprays with garlic cloves printed on them. Bien. O sea, una es alérgica a los gatos. Otra es alérgica a... al ajo. Bueno, la que sí es alérgica a los gatos. Y no sé quién será alérgica al ajo. Three different pillows and three different blankets? That's odd. Many life threads were caught with these, I suppose. A framed picture of the forbidden forest. Hey, there's an inscription by the artist on the frame. Happy birthday, Atropos. Yours, Bella. Bien. O sea, el lugar preferido... A framed pic. Hey, happy birthday, Atropos. Yours, Bella. El lugar preferido de Atropos es el framed... el bosque prohibido. Happy... Son demasiadas cosas y no me las está escribiendo. Estaría bien que me las escribiera en algún sitio. It's just an empty picture frame that's been hung up around a big hole in the wall. When you look through the hole, you see the Fates Garden. Bien, el segundo lugar preferido de una de ellas es el jardín. It shows the harbor. El muelle. Let's see what's inside. It's locked. Don't worry. 
I won't prick myself on the spindle and sleep for a hundred years. It's a poster about how to improve a room's funk shui. It's also full of spelling mistakes. But who am I to judge? Tell your furry Malkin to kep of my side of the bet? Claro, es que estoy... Estoy descubriendo cosas, pero como no me las guarda... sé cómo, cómo descubrir. O sea, yo lo sé, pero en el juego no sé cómo, cómo hago que Prim se entere de eso. Bien, sabemos que ella es alérgica... A ver, ella es alérgica a los gatos. Y le gusta el, el martini de ajo. No sé qué más hacer. Welcome back, Sunflower. I think I'm needed elsewhere. See you later, Lackey. May your journey be filled with love and light. Voy a hablar con... con Echo. A ver si es él el que le tengo que decir las cosas. Hi, Echo. Hi, Prim. Acerca de nuestra canción. About our song. Yes. Vamos a enseñar la canción de las Moiras. Tienes corazones que conquistar. Let's try singing our song for the... Será esto. A ver. You have some hearts to win. Have you been able to find out anything about their pets yet? I think so. What about their favorite places? Yep. Their favorite drinks? Yes, I came across a clue. And their allergies? Yes. Ah, uh, Haki. That's great. You're a real investigator, Prim. Nothing ventured, nothing gained, I guess. Atropos! When seeking out some inner peace. Um. Es. El bosque, tú, bueno, no lo sé. El bosque, el muelle, no me acuerdo. Tengo que apuntarlo, ¿ves? Como no lo apunta en, en su diario, no me acuerdo. El bosque no era. El jardín. Your garden sets your mind at ease. That was wrong. No. So wrong. Sorry, darling. I'm afraid you have to convince all of us to win us over. But I'm proud of you for trying. See you later. Vale, voy a tener lo que apuntar. Como no me lo apunta el juego, lo voy a apuntar yo. Qué remedio. Vale, por lo menos ya sé cómo, cómo Prim se entera de todo. Entonces. Vamos a hacerlo por hermana. A ver, esta es Atropos. No, esta es la Kesis. Y... Y hay que saber. Mascota.
eh, bebida. Lugar favorito. Y alergia. Entonces, la que sí sabemos que la bebida... Vamos a... It's the drink, man. These must be the, the first drink on the menu is... Aji, ajitini. Which seems to be short for garlic martini. Ugh. There are also instructions how to make that. The next one is Ivy Punch. And somebody wrote also for my fish. Ponche de hiedra para mi pez. Round it off with... Bien. ¿De quién es el pez? El ponche de hiedra es para mi pez. Sabemos que aquí está el pez, pero no sabemos de quién es. It's surely only practicing its backstroke, right? De quien sea el pez, también sabremos en la bebida. To vacuum cat hair all morning. Bien. La que sí es alérgica a los gatos. A framed picture of the forbidden forest. Hey, there's an inscription by the artist on the frame. Happy birthday, Atropos. Yours, Bella. Atropos. Su lugar favorito es el bosque prohibido. El bosque. It shows the harbor. El muelle, y ya está. ¿Qué más podemos sacar de aquí? Ah, la medicina, la alergia. Inside the drawer, there are anti-allergy sprays with garlic cloves printed on them. Es alérgica. Alguien es alérgica a, 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 al ajo. No sabemos quién. I find your fishy quiet confusing. I find your fishy quiet confusing. Esto no me dice nada. Solo me dice quién lo ha escrito. Lo ha escrito la quesis. Sabemos que la quesis no es la dueña del pez porque dice su pececín me resulta bastante desconciertante entonces la que sí no tiene de mascota ni el pez y supongo que tampoco los gatos porque si es alérgica no tiene sentido pero me falta un, una mascota Three different pillows and three. Tell your furry Malkin to keep of my side of the bet. It's a poster about how to improve a room's funk shui. It's also full of spelling mistakes. But who am I to judge? Don't worry. I won't prick myself on the spindle and sleep for a hundred years. No sé si me he dejado algo atrás. Parte del cofre. En el cofre tiene que haber algo... Alguna pista. Seguro.
Aquí vemos el cuadro de un gato. ¿Qué más? Hay otra carta aquí. Voy a hablar con ella a ver si me da información que no haya apuntado. Solo lo de la ortografía, es lo único que me dice de ella. I think I need it elsewhere. See you later, Lackey. May your journey be filled with love and light. It's the drink menu. These must be the fate's favorite drink. The first drink on the menu is a gart. There are. The next one is Ivy Punch. And somebody wrote also for my fish, Schrodinger under it. The menus rounded off with root beer without exclamation point Ivy. Si sí, tendrá algo que ver la cama. Porque cada cama tiene... Ahí está, cada cama tiene una almohada diferente. Three different pillows and three different blankets? That's odd. Y tres mantas diferentes. No puedo sacar más información. Quizás tenga que seguir. A ver, el bosque prohibido sabemos que es el lugar favorito de Atropos. No sé si será importante eso. Mira, Cerbero. Kiri said the Phoenix lives here and I need one of its feathers. I don't care if they call you a goddess, Persephone. I know what you truly are. You are nothing more than a second-class herb witch. Do you think that is the appropriate way to speak to your queen? You'll never be my queen. You're just some fancy foreign lady who thinks she can roam around these woods like they're her personal playground. People like you, Hank, are the reason the realm of the dead has such a bad reputation. It's no wonder you don't have any friends. Don't listen to her, Hank. I'm here for you. I know, Spruce, and you are the best friend anyone could ever wish for. Pues tenemos a Persephone, tenemos a Cerbero. ¿Este quién es? Hank. Y Ramiro. I hope you don't mind me asking, but what are you two fighting about? Isn't it as clear as night? That woman's hell bent on ruining our precious woods. She's like the poster child for everything that's messed up in our realm. I'm not here to ruin anything. Quite the opposite, actually. I'm all about making this place bloom, thrive, and come alive. But we don't want life. These branches don't need leaves. 
Never have, never will. I prefer my roots all tangled up and my soil as dry as a bone. Spruce, you tell her. I'm rooting for you, Hank. <sighs> Not again. He pretends he knows what the tree wants. I do know. I'm Hank, by the way, and I'm the guardian of these woods. Don't pay him any mind, Prim. Wait, how do you know my name? You see, Daughter of Death, it's your fragrance that sets you apart. I detect the subtle notes of dandelion spores and a faint hint of tulip. People from around here don't smell like that. And your father told me about you. So, welcome to the realm of the dead. Who are you? Oh, I totally forgot to introduce myself. Sorry, this place has a way of making me forget my manners. I'm Persephone, the goddess of spring. And, well, recently, I've also taken on the role of Queen of the Underworld. That's cool. I'm only the goddess of losing socks in the laundry. Well, look at that. I finally get to meet someone with a sense of humor down here. Hey, I'm back. I can see that, Prim. How can I help you? Es la mujer de Hades, ¿no? Wait, you're Hades' wife, right? Yes. So, you're not from here either? As Zeus is my witness, no. And believe me, when my husband first brought me here, I was so... You mean after he kidnapped you? Call it what you want. It's been a massive culture shock. I totally know what you mean. But with time, it got better. And I started to feel more at home here. At a home with my loving husband. Looks like a classic case of Stockholm Syndrome, if you ask me. Shush, you grumpy piñata. Eh, me gustan las flores que tienes en los pies. I... like those flowers at your feet. Why, thanks. These were dead daisies. I just gave them a little boost when I got here today. They're disgusting. You gave them a boost? I am the goddess of spring, remember? I can't create flowers from nothing, but give me a dead one and I can bring it back to life in no time. Pretty impressive. I never had a green thumb. Even the fake plants in my room died. Not so surprising considering your family background, don't you think? Hmm. Maybe. Tienes un collar muy chulo. Es una granada. Mm. That's a pretty cool necklace. A pomegranate? Oh, that old thing? Yes, a pomegranate. There are far more precious pieces in my collection, but somehow I find it hard to part with. For one thing, it reminds me of my early days in the realm of the dead. And secondly, it's quite useful to make Cerberus here follow me. The old boy would die for the taste of pomegranate seeds. Curioso perro. Interesting dog? That's Cerberus. Isn't he lovely? He's an evil abomination. Easy there, Spruce. I won't let Cerberus pull that stunt on you again. What stunt? Oh, nothing really. Anyway, I wish Cerberus would relieve himself already. I've been waiting for what feels like an eternity. No. Hmm. Hank habla solo. Is Hank talking to himself? Yes. After a few lonely years hanging from that tree, I think he kind of snapped. A few years? How long has this fight been going on? A while, I guess. Bye, Persephone. Take care, Prim. Come back any time. I'm glad to have another non-underworldling here. Maybe it will lighten your father's spirits a little. I have the feeling he's getting grumpier with every soul he reaps. Tell me something I don't already know. He's always been a grumpy old sourpuss. 
But for the last decade or so, it's been getting even worse. He's obsessed with maintaining the balance between life and death. The slightest disturbance sets him off. Oh, you mean like when a person's soul is returned to their body after they were killed by mistake? Just asking for a friend. That was oddly specific, but yes, that would do it. I wonder what these guys are doing here. Except for, well, hanging around. I wonder what these guys are... What an interesting dog. Can I pet him? Yes. Absolutely not. Of course she can. That's Spruce, Hank's imaginary tree friend. You're imaginary. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, a thousand times yes. This is beneath me. Mom always said, the wise know when to quit. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Ah! Hi, Hank. Hey there, kiddo. Where are your manners, eh? Don't you want to say a little hello to Spruce, too? Hank, Spruce is just a tree. And he can't talk. It's just you doing a weird thing with your mouth. Just a tree? Was John Lemon just a tree? What about Jennifer Lopez? R.L. Pine? Laurel and Hardy? Annie Oakley? Were they just all just trees? Okay, fine. Hello, Spruce. So now he's not saying anything? Nope. He's still barking mad at you. <laughs> Great. I've managed to anger a tree. Se nota que la traducción se hizo en España. Eh, ¿por qué estás colgado del árbol con una soga al cuello? I know adults do strange things sometimes, so I'm kind of afraid to ask, but... Why are you hanging from this tree with a noose around your neck? Well, me and my friends here, we're environmental activists. Oh, so you fight for the survival of the forest. Survival of the forest? What are you talking about? We don't want it alive. We're fighting to keep these woods just as dead, withered and decayed as they've always been. Oh, okay. And you're hanging there because... Well, as long as I'm dangling here, Persephone can't get her hands on my trusty old tree buddy, Spruce, to work her black magic on him. Black magic? Hank, I just want to help the forest flourish. That's what it's supposed to do. Not on this side of the curtain, little lady. How long have you been hanging there, Hank? Uh, uh, he oh, um... Hanging there, Hank. Not long enough, it seems, since this self-proclaimed goddess is still threatening us. Oh, must be lonely. Not at all. Hank's got me to keep him company. <laughs> oh, Spruce, with a buddy like you, nothing in this world is going to bring me down. ¿Cómo haces para poner la voz de Ramiro? How do you make Spruce talk? What do you mean, make Spruce talk? I mean, it's obvious you're the one who's actually talking and not this very much inanimate tree. I'm just curious how you do it. <gasps> Spruce! Can you believe that? <laughs> this girl's been in the realm of the dead for, what, five minutes? <laughs> and she thinks she's an expert in talking to trees when I've spent my whole life here. I can't believe it, Hank. You know, lass, Spruce may be many things. An annoying know-it-all, a real slob. You should look in his mouth, he keeps everything there. But he is definitely not a normal tree. What is it that Cerberus does to Spruce? You tell her, Hank. I just don't have the buds. You know, Prim, this forest is packed with trees. There must be thousands, but that three-headed beast always marks poor Spruce. He marks him? 
You mean... That jet, it's merciless. It's more powerful than a fire hose. Ugh. The humiliation. The indignity. For no reason. I know Spruce is only a tree, but now I kind of feel sorry for him. I have no idea how, but I'm sure Persephone is behind this. She must have done something to Spruce, and I'm going to prove it. Thank Hades, Cerberus doesn't seem to feel the call of nature today. ¿Alguna idea de cómo cruzar ese río? Any idea how I can cross that river? Any attempt to cross would be pointless. Believe me, I've seen many try and fail. But there must be a way. Hmm. Well, maybe the river can be dammed. But it would only work at a spot where the current isn't as strong. Like at the harbor, for example. The harbor? Do you know how to get there? Of course I do. There was a time when I was more, you know, mobile. And there's a secret shortcut through the forest that leads to the harbor. So, will you tell me about it? Of course not. It's a secret shortcut. You know, I got a spider thing that can show me people's secrets. If I want to, I'm going to find out anyway. Are you threatening me? I don't know. Am I? <clears throat> All right, lass. Calm down. No need to get obnoxious. Uh, I'll tell you the way. Thank you, Hank. Now I should be able to find the harbor. Eso se me había olvidado. Se me había olvidado por completo. Bye, Hank. Hang loose. Oh, never heard that one before. I should write that one down, should I? O sea, que ahora puedo llegar hasta el muelle. Antes no lo había intentado y a lo mejor me decía que no podía. Pero por cierto, no no había probado a usar el el arachnóculo este. I assume singers and songwriters don't have secrets. They're wearing their heart on their sleeve. Or in Echo's case, somewhere else outside of their bodies. Lo voy a probar con la quesis. Strange. It doesn't work with her. Hmm. Maybe the fates are too powerful. Pues no funciona con ella. Solo funciona con personas, ¿verdad? I hate to admit it, but somehow you're pretty adorable. No se puede usar. There's no need for an eyeball with spider legs here. Pues nada, no se puede. Eh, voy a volver al bosque. Hank, don't be so stubborn. Why don't you come down so we can talk it out? You'd like that, wouldn't you? The moment I budge from here, you're going to snap your fingers and old Spruce will start sprouting like crazy. I'm not going anywhere. No way. Pues supongo que con Persephone tampoco funciona. Pues sí. There seems to be nothing to uncover. Gato. Ah. Uh. Hank was right. Persephone was messing with the tree by oh, letting a cat pee on it. The poor dog just wants to mark his territory again. Vale, ¿y qué hago? There's no need for an eyeball with spider legs here. Hmm. Hank does have a secret. Somehow he makes his tree friend talk. But I'm sure I'll be able to discover it without magic this time. I mean, I'm clever. At least, that's what my mom always told me. Bye, Hank. Hang loose. Oh, never heard that one before. I should write that one down, should I? Ya que es el secreto, ¿de qué me sirve saberlo ahora? Sí. 
sé lo que hiciste con el gato. I know what you did with the cat. I still have no idea what you're talking about, young lady. Pues no. I know what you did with the cat. I still have no idea what you're talking about, young lady. Bye, Persephone. I can't reach it. No creo que la guadaña sirva aquí para algo. I don't want to cut this. El frasco está vacío. Se sí, voy a ir al puerto, al muelle. Hanks directions. I know how to get to the harbor now. Se supone que aquí. That's the harbor. According to Curies, the ferryman can help me find Tristan's soul on the river. Se supone que aquí hay que hacer una presa. Y seguramente, mira, aquí lo estoy viendo. Seguramente hay que usar la, los castores zombies estos que vimos. Y los castores zombies lo que utilizan es son cadáveres para hacer sus presas. Cristales rotos, saca corchos. Looks like somebody threw a party here. Judging from the smell, a pretty garlicky party. Another desperate attempt to keep the river from overflowing. The river broke through the barrier here and spilled over its banks. Now it's rushing inland. What is all this stuff? And why is it piled up here? Looks like it's been a long time since anybody used it. Now it's just a painful reminder of better days. Painful? and dusty. Marca pequeña. Y hay una llave. Oh, a key. I wonder who lost it. I'll take it with me. Maybe I'll find its owner, or even better, whatever it unlocks. Bien, sabemos que aquí alguien tomó algo con mucho ajo y sabemos que la quesis le gusta la bebida con ajo o sea, a lo mejor esta llave llave de oro podría ser la que abre el cofre I can't navigate the river by myself I need the ferryman oh It's just like those notice boards in supermarkets with offers, want ads, and the occasional lonely hearts column. But at second glance, the notices here read a little differently. The River Styx Ballet Ensemble is looking for new members. It's fun, it's elegant, it's free. Ask for Bella. Visit the world famous Phoenix, fifth tree on the left in the Forbidden Forest. Mm, ahí está el Fénix. For sale at Hades Haberdashery. Every variety of caps, capes, hats, and drapes. Finest quality wool and linen, offering rich new shades of black. Are you weary to the bone? You don't have to be. Get active. Join the Shrunken Heads Fitness Studio today. All workouts can be performed without limbs. Dispensador de tickets. ¿Tickets para qué? Hmm. 
I got number 59, but the display says 58? The numbers seem to be mirrored now. It's got, it's got 59 printed on it. It might seem like I have a plan, but I really, really don't. Place your number on the counter. The booth is open, but I don't see anybody. Now I got number 60. Está diciendo que tengo que hacer esto hasta encontrar el... 61. Hasta llegar al 82, no puede ser. A ver hasta dónde me deja. 62. It doesn't seem to work anymore. Okay, somebody's really trying to keep this window safe. I wonder why. No creo que sea esta llave, ¿no? The key doesn't unlock this. Antes de seguir por aquí, por, por donde está el castor. Voy a volver aquí a ver si esta llave abre el cofre que está arriba. It fits! Let's see what's inside. A bag of mole food. Saco de pienso para the topos. Holy grail! Treat your beloved subterranean dweller to our new improved formula. Pomegranate flavor. Sabor a granada. Mm. Sabor a granada. A ver, si voy con esto hasta el bosque. If you hate me, then... And miss enjoying the sight of you... Esto ya... Siguen peleándose estos dos. Si uso el pienso para topo... Con la boca de Ramiro... No. Nope. I don't want to do that. Y con Cerbero... Do you want some of this, buddy? He seems to love it. Tengo más. Ahora. No. No. I don't want to do that. Entonces, ¿para qué? Do you want some of this, buddy? He seems to love it. Quizás sea para después. That doesn't make sense. No. 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 Okay. Time to assess Bruce's oral hygiene. Ah, eso no lo había hecho antes. Wow. And Mom always said my room was a disaster area. Whew, it wasn't easy considering the mess in there, but I found a book. Oh, you can take that old tome. I don't need it anymore. I've also spotted a rope in the tree's mouth. Can I take that too? Rope? Oh, <laughs> that must be Spruce's dental floss. Is what? I know. Dental care is overrated, isn't it? So, can I take the rope or not? Well, since it belongs to Spruce, you cannot take it unless he allows it. <sighs> That's Spruce, Hank's imaginary tree friend. Mm. 
no se ha llevado la cuerda. Y esto es libro de ventriloquia. So that's how Hank makes his tree friend talk. He's a ventriloquist. Claro, ya sabemos cómo habla. Habla. Es ventríloco, pero ¿qué? ¿Qué hago con eso? Uh, let's see if that works. You know what, Tank? I must confess, I don't need that rope anymore. Ah, vale. The unusually sympathetic young woman can have it. Are you sure, Spruce? Well, if you say so, go ahead and take it, girl. Así me llevo la cuerda. Got it. La cuerda va a ser para usarla en el en el pozo. Y no sé si tendrá algo que ver con el cubo. Cuerda con el cubo. Sí. Y el cubo con cuerda en el pozo. A ver. No sube. Ahora. Ahora puedo bajar. Theoretically, I could descend into the well like this, but why should I? Pues no lo sé. Que hay alguien debajo. Nope. Not a Theoretically, I could descend into the well like this, but why should I? Vale, por ahora entonces nada. Pues voy a ir a por... a por los castores zombies. Piezas sueltas, una caja, no arena, pájaros entre y con un símbolo de ay, en, en, en pregunta, el arroyo. Letrero de calle. Una rana. Un castor zombie. Y una presa inacabada. ¿Qué más? Un brazo aquí. Una carta. A ver. You know what? Severed limbs have served me well so far. I'll take them all. Se lo lleva todo. 
Todos los brazos se los lleva. Unlike my skeleton arm, these things are still covered with rotten flesh. Ugh. I should really stop picking up everything I see. Madaña con brazos, no, ¿verdad? No. Like my skeleton. Pieza suelta. Unfinished business. Looks like something is supposed to be built here. It's a box from Daikia. There's an address to Lumberjaws Woodchew, 14 Nod Logs Lane, Tartarus 66666. Let's see what's inside. There's a note inside. Dear Finder, please assemble the device I ordered and then lend me a hand. Kind regards, LW. Hmm. Hey, there's also some kind of assembly manual. I'll take it with me. De vez en cuando aparece aquí una mano. No sé si tendrá importancia. Plano de presa. Plano de catapulta. It's a Daikia ad for a wooden catapult. Huh. It's a Daikia ad for huh. It's a Daikia huh. Ah. No le vuelva a dar la vuelta. Los planos de una catapulta. What if I try to build this? A ver. ¿Cómo se.? Ah, bien. Ahí. Esto ahí. Claro, al colocar mal esta pieza, creo que está mal. Todo así, creo. Todo lo demás estará mal. Sí, yo creo que va ahí. No sé, estaba así. Estaba ahí, estaba ahí. Va. Ahí. Aquí. Aquí. Y las cuatro ruedas. I knew it. That's why the part seemed wrong. Because they were meant to make a catapult, not a dam. For my very first catapult, it's not too bad, I guess. Um, fire! Wow! I wonder if I can load it with anything. No sand! They seem to be interested in those bags. No arena, a ver si corto los sacos que hay dentro. Let's see what's in them. Nothing unusual, just two skeleton birds enjoying a healthy portion of no sand. Armed now. <laughs> um, fire. Oh. <laughs> 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 Bien, ya está. The river isn't flowing into the forest anymore. 
That was more fun than I expected. Pues ya está, ya está terminada la presa. Se ha quedado a dormir. No sé la rana de qué sirve. No sé para qué sirve. I might need no sand at some point. No, se la va a llevar. Definitely no sand. Mm, definitely no sand. No arena. Pero no me dice lo que es. Yo no me puedo llevar así. Ah, no sand. No, no me puedo llevar más. Bien, a ver, ahora en qué ha cambiado esto. What itches? But hey, I'm just going to scratch it. Do you ever wish you could scratch your foot too, Hank? Isn't the itching driving you mad? You monster! Hey, the water is really gone. Thank you, little beaver. Y ya puedo pasar. Dear visitors of the mighty phoenix, avoid excessive noise around the firebird since it <laughs> suffers from spontaneous self-immolation when exposed to loud sounds. Bien, para eso está la cabeza esta. Advertencia. Dear visitors of the mighty avoid excessive Es lo mismo. Esqueleto. Y el sacacorcho va a ser para quitarle el corcho de la boca. Porque ya nos dijo antes que no le podía quitar el corcho con las manos. Hey, maybe the head will scream loud enough to wake up the phoenix, but I can't pull the cork out. That little guy has strong jaws. Let's see if this will work. Come on, Grandpa Phoenix, rise and shine. Not what I meant. Si ya te lo han dicho, ¿qué pasaría eso? ¿Cómo apago el fuego del, en el bosque prohibido? There's a new phoenix egg in the flames. But I can't get it as long as the nest is burning. A ver, ¿qué tengo por aquí? En un frasco vacío. Aquí hay una carta. En un frasco vacío. Y a lo mejor si lo lleno de agua. This path directly led me to the harbor. If I'd only known that a little earlier. I don't want to fill the... I don't want to fill the empty bottle with that. Pues no. Cerberus, darling, do you want to hear a joke? 
What happened when Hank tried to high-five his stupid tree? It left him hanging! No creo que en la boca haya nada más, ¿no? Let's see what else is in there. A casket ball card. Ah, una carta. There's nothing interesting left in there. Hank's activist friends. Won't help me putting out the fire, I'm afraid. This won't. Pues no sé qué usar. El pozo, no sé. I don't want to fill the em Theoretically, I could descend into the well like this, but why should I? volver al muelle The scythe is of no use here. Another desperate attempt to keep the river from overflowing. Sé qué hacer. It's got 59 printed on it. It might seem like I have a plan, but I really, really don't. That number is not being served right now. You may refer to the display over there. Please wait in line. Line? What line? There's nobody here. A ver, que se le pueda dar la vuelta a esto. Tiene que significar. You seem to be mirrored now. Tiene que significar algo. 62. What a strange idea. These two don't fit to... That number is not being served right now. You may refer to the display over there. Please wait in line. Ah! I hate bureaucracy. No sé si modificando... Habrá que modificar o los tickets o el cartel. I don't want to cut this.
What a weird looking alarm clock. Golpear cartel. Ah. I think I broke it. 62, ahora sí. 62. That number is not being. Wait. That is the right number. How did you. Never mind. I am Kari, the fairy. What do you want? Gosh, finally. I'd like to book a river crossing. Then you've come to the right place. But as is our custom, it will cost you the gold coin you were buried with. <laughs> the gold coin I was buried with. Um, yeah, sure, 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 sure. Just, uh, wait a second, let me check. Uh, oh, that's too bad. <laughs> I think my bereaved put it in my other coffin. Um, can't I just... You don't have a gold coin, do you? No, nope, sorry, I don't. Don't worry, that's how it is with just about everybody these days. That's why we don't use our glorious Erebus anymore. And what does that mean? Oh, it just means you're doomed to drift underwater as a zombie-like ghost spirit for all eternity. I wish you a pleasant afterlife. Goodbye. Oh, he must be kidding me. I don't think I need the tickets anymore. I'll throw them away. Dentro del... Dentro del pozo no habrá monedas, ¿no? La gente tira monedas a los pozos. Para eso bajar al pozo. Theoretically, I could descend into... Pues no. ¿Qué más? Sigo teniendo el libro, a ver. From now on, I'm only going to play death metal. Pardon? <laughs> May your journey no longer be blocked by senseless rules, Sunflower. Feel free to take the key to your aunt's lab. Sorry, Prim. It doesn't work like that. Que con la poca información que tengo. Hi, Prim. Who's your favorite singer? Oh, that's an easy question. It's the one and only Joe Stidgen, the man with the most beautiful and loudest voice. Cool. I think I've already read his name somewhere. Maybe you can get some inspiration from him? Musical inspiration, definitely. But regarding his private life... In his late twenties, he owed Clotho, one of Lackey's sisters, a whole lot of money. He went to bargain with her, but was never seen again. Okay, that's... Vale, no es la cabeza esta que yo tengo. Seven Club. Happens to the best of us. Bye, Echo. Au revoir, young Miss Reaper. No es esta cabeza. This little fellow has the loudest voice I've ever heard. But he's quiet now. Thanks to the cork I gave him. He likes that cork so much, I can't even pull it out with my hands anymore. I could pull the cork out with this, but I don't need a screaming shrunken head shredding my nerves right now. There's no need for unbearably loud... Oh, no. Pin 
pintura. ¿Para qué me sirve la pintura? There's no need for. Hi, Echo. Hi, Prim. About our song. Yes. Don't worry about last time. Let's try our song again. I have a good feeling. If you say so. Clotho! You suffer from monotony. Um... De Cloto no sé nada. No tengo nada escrito. What do I care? Just leave me be! Disgusting. Mm. Simply disgusting. Sorry, darling. I'm afraid you have to convince all of us to win us over. But I'm proud of you for trying. See you later. Nada. Pues yo creía que a lo mejor algunas pistas estaban fuera, pero creo que todas las pistas están aquí. Well, it's not a prim flap. Puedo usar el mismo truco, a ver. I could send my friend into the garden through the flap, but why should I? Para que te abra la puerta. Well, it's not a prim flap. Nope. Claro, claro, no lo había pensado. Cada despertador despierta a una de las hermanas. Entonces, ¿este despertará a quién? Um, Lachesis? No. Lachesis was nowhere to be seen. But you are. Confused by the reply, Death's daughter stood motionless, facing Atropos, the inescapable cutter of threads. And all she was able to say was... This, This is creepy. creepy. Pineapple, Pineapple syrup. syrup! Stop, Stop that. that! Okay, once again, four dummies. You're not lackey. It was then that Prim realized that the person in front of her was indeed not Lachesis, but her sister Atropos, the goddess of the future. I am officially confused. Vale, esta es Atropos, la del futuro. Eh, ¿Puedo entrar en el laboratorio de Keres? Could I, by any chance, get inside Keres's lab? Atropos had to decline Prim's request, politely reminding her of her aunt's unreliability in financial affairs, and in remembering in general. What do you do with the life threads after you cut them? Atropos would have loved to tell Prim that she respectfully stored the cut threads in a custom-made gold vessel where they would be preserved for all eternity. But the truth was that she threw them into the garden for the cat to mm. Por eso necesito entrar al jardín. Ah, 
about Lachesis and Echo. Atropos was expecting Prim to have already been indoctrinated by her lovesick little sister. Well, love isn't really a sickness, is it? Though Atropos had never been in love herself, what she knew about it was that it would always lead to great pain in the future, one way or another. I don't have much experience either, but I can imagine it's worth it anyway. It seems like Echo's intentions are genuine. Wait until you get to know him better. From what she had seen and heard from him so far, Atropos doubted that. Why are you talking so weird? Feeling a little hurt at being called weird, Atropos explained that, as the future goddess, she did not experience time as, for instance, mortals did. Everything that happened, no matter when, felt like a distant memory to her. Which was why she chose to speak exclusively in the past tense. Prim was even more confused. No, no, it's not the same if I do it. Eh, si sabes el futuro, puedes decirme cómo acabará mi aventura. Wait a minute. If you know the future, can you tell me how my journey will end? Atropos politely informed Prim that, in all timelines in which she did tell her that, the world ended in flames. Oh. Tú eres la que mata a la gente, ¿no? You're the one who kills people, right? Ignoring the judgmental implication of Prim's question, Atropos calmly pointed out that all she did was cut threads. She had more in common with a tailor than with an axe-wielding psychopath. Well, if that's what lets you sleep at night. Tiene algún sentido despedirme cuando ya sabes que me voy a ir. Does it even make sense to say goodbye when you already know I'll be leaving? Atropos had been successfully avoiding all questions about time paradoxes lately, and did not want to start dealing with them now. Oh, I see. Bien, pues voy a despertar. Ah, esta es la del gato. Let me guess. Atropos was here before, wasn't she? She never blinks. Have you noticed that? It's like she actively wants to coat our eyeballs in dust. Wait, who am I talking to? <sighs> if this archaic uttering is what you call talking, then you're talking to Clotho, the illustrious spinner of fate. I'm confused. And I'm so weary of always being the smartest person in the room. Bien, Cloto es la del gato. Mascota, gato. Bueno, ya sabemos algo. Eh, voy a hacer lo mismo. No podría dejarnos entrar a Keres y a mí en su laboratorio. You wouldn't happen to be willing to let Kiri's and me into her lab, would you? I'm sure you know the answer. Is it... yes? Okay, okay, I got it. What do you think about Lachesis and Echo? Of course, she's already roped you into her inappropriate endeavor. But she can jolly well forget about it. But why? Echo seems like a nice guy. A few days ago, this so-called siren came here and just started mumbling some incomprehensible, impolite gibberish. He did not treat me or my sisters with the respect we deserve. If he had, I'd perhaps be willing to talk about it. But I don't really think he's capable of doing that. Eh, ser una Moira debe ser interesantísimo. Me encantaría saber más de vosotras. Being a fate must be so interesting. I'd love to learn more about you guys. Like, what are your favorite 
Forget it, child. That's none of your business. Mm, shoot. Eh, bonito gato. Nice cat. His name is Lucifer. Can I pet him? <laughs> By all means. Caveat allurophil. Unfortunately, I must leave. Oh, thank Hades. Vale, el gato se le puede hacer algo al gato. Kitty, 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 kitty. ¡Ah! No para. Pis de gato. Esto es lo que voy a usar. A ver dónde está. El frasco vacío. Ah, se ha cortado. Espera. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. I hope I know what I'm doing here. ¿Por qué pis de gato? No creo que esto sirva para apagar, para apagar el fuego. Pis de gato. Esto tiene algo que ver con el árbol. For us humans, these threads determine how long we get to be alive. And here, they just lie around on a makeshift bar. The afterlife is strange. None of them looks torn or broken. Tristan's must be somewhere else. Creo que sé cómo apagar el fuego. I have a joke. You might be able to appreciate Persephone. What do you call a wolf with Stockholm syndrome? A dog. <laughs> A ver, yo creo que el pis de gato hay que echarlo donde está el fuego. Y viene Cerbero y se mea encima y lo apaga. No, I... won't help to put out the fire, but I'm gonna spray it anyway. It might seem like a rather random thing to do, but trust me, there is a big plan behind it all. At least I hope so. No. No pasa nada. Eh, algo hay que hacer. Hay que ir atrayendo... Al perro poco a poco. O quizás lo del pienso para topos. Hay que usar el pienso en algún sitio. This won't help me putting out the fire, I'm afraid. That doesn't make sense. A ver. No, I usually don't go around spray. Hay que ir atrayéndolo poco a poco, a lo mejor. No, I usually don't go around spraying random things with homemade cat pee perfume. No. Do you want some of this, buddy? He seems to love it. Pero no me sigue. Not a good idea. That doesn't... Do you want some of this, buddy? He seems to love it. These two don't fit together. I shouldn't. Algo así tiene que ser. For the realm of the dead, these flowers look unusually 
Alive? Yeah, that's it. That's because they are. It was pretty hard even for me, but I managed to make them grow. No, I... That doesn't... Pues no sé cómo lo hago. No me sigue. I still love your necklace. And so does my Cerberus. He could eat pomegranate seeds all night long. Persephone. Y por mucho que le dé. Do you want some of this, buddy? No me sigue, ¿no? A lo mejor hay que darle varias veces. Do you want some of this, buddy? He seems to love it. No creo que haya que conseguir el collar. Not a good idea. No. That doesn't make any sense. The Moly Grail. Treat your beloved subterranean. The path to the Phoenix. This won't help me putting out the fire, I'm afraid. I don't want to do that. Helps a lot, I guess. No va a venir. A lot helps a lot, I guess. No, I usually. Quizás primero haya que quitarle el pis de gato a este árbol. There's nothing interesting left in there. That ain't gonna cut it. That doesn't. Hank, have you been gaining weight? My branch hurts! Spruce, is that you? Hank, have you been gaining weight? My branch hurts! Spruce, is that you? Oh. I can't use my new ventriloquism skills on that. I'd really love to get myself a salad, but then again I... Don't want to eat my friends. Oh, friends, stop that. No sé qué hacer. While I'm well aware of the awesome power of no sand, it seems to be absolutely useless here. While I'm well aware.
A ver, vamos a repasar lo que sabemos de las moiras. A ver, sabemos que Cloto tiene un gato. I find your fishy quiet confusing. Y según esta nota, que la ha escrito la Kesis, dice I find your fishy tu pececín yet confusing. Entonces el pez es de Atropos. Bien. Luego aquí sabemos que el lugar preferido de Atropos es, es el bosque. A framed picture of the forbidden fort. Hey, there's happy birthday Atropos. Yours, Bella. It shows the harbor. El muelle. Sabemos que en el muelle decía que había una fiesta con bebida de ajo. Y la bebida de ajo es de la quesis, así que el lugar preferido de la quesis tiene que ser el muelle. Entonces el que queda, que, que es lógico, Cloto, el lugar preferido de Cloto, It's just an empty frame. When you look the... es el jardín. You... Que es normal, porque ella nos ha dicho que es donde pone todos los, los hilos cortados. Entonces esto es Cloto con el jardín. Bien, nos queda saber qué mascota tiene la Kesis. Solo hemos visto un gato y un pez. Nada más. Y sabemos que alguien tiene alergia al ajo. Pero no sabemos quién. El juego está mal, ¿eh? El juego está mal. Bueno, ahora... Sí, ahora funciona. A ver. Ahí está mal. No debería aparecer por aquí. Se supone que entra por dentro. Así, como debería ser. Y este está mal también. Al subir y al bajar está mal. No quedan tantas cosas ya. Quizás con lo que sabemos... Quizás podemos descubrir con la canción, podemos descubrir... ¿Cuál es la mascota que nos queda? Hi Echo. Hi Prim. About our song. Yes. Come on, let's give it another try. Atropos. When seeking out some inner peace. Um... Atropos es el bosque. The forest sets your mind at ease. Not wrong at all. Cierto. Although you grumble grumpily. Ah. Uh, pez disfruta de tu compañía. Atropos es el pez. Your fish enjoys your company. Indeed. Vale, esto es Cloto 
You suffer from monotony. Um... Y es el jardín. Your garden is your place to be. <laughs> Remarkably, that's correct. I know you have an allergy. Um... Y aquí viene lo que no sé. Alérgica a qué? A la hiedra. Ay, eso lo dice, claro. Lo de la alergia sale de... Eh, sale de, de las bebidas. Es verdad, no me había dado cuenta. Ahora que recuerdo que pone que la hiedra es su maldición de la... sale de las bebidas. Voy a poner, yo que sé, hiedra. And Ivy brings you agony. Oh. Vale, hiedra. Surprisingly. Acerté. Do not forget to sing for Lachesis, Siren. A friend in needs a friend indeed. Um. Eh, topo. Es el único que queda. Es pez, gato o topo. El topo es el único que, que me quedaba. Y algo me dice que el topo está en el jardín. Your mole is just the friend you need. Actually, true. When all you want to hide away. Um. Y ella es el muelle, el muelle. The harbor's where you like to stay. Not bad. Sunshine, you did it! Clotho and Atropos have agreed! We can go on a date soon! Really? That's amazing! I'll pick you up. And we can go to your favorite place, the forest. <coughs> <laughs> I mean, the harbor! I can't wait, my love! Thank you so much for helping Echo, dear. Was it that obvious? <laughs> Not to my sisters, apparently. <laughs> do you still need to get into your aunt's lap? Yes, I do. Then, if you should try getting in again, I might just be a little distracted with my preparations for my date. Oh, thanks, Lackey. Claro, y de aquí del menú este, es de donde saca It's the drink menu. These la bebida. There are also the next one is Ivy Pun. Ponche de hiedra. He wrote also for my fish. Short atropos. The menus rounded off with root beer. Y la cerveza. Exclamation point Ivy. No, no, no. Ponche de hiedra es de cloto y la cerveza es de atropos. Ahí está. Porque la cerveza tiene hiedra y... Y Atropos es alérgica. No, el ponche tiene hiedra y Atropos es alérgica. Así que ya está iría todo así. Pero bueno, ya está, ya está hecho. Pero ahora me queda una cosa. Yo creo que esto... Tendría que haberlo averiguado, lo del topo, por ejemplo, lo tenía que haber averiguado entrando en la puerta del jardín. Lackey, can I have the key to my aunt's lab now? As I promised, darling, feel free as a bird. No creo que esta llave sea la misma del jardín. The key doesn't fit here. Claro. Pues me, creo que me he saltado un paso es abrir la puerta del jardín de alguna manera. This must be the door to Kiri's lab. I could go into Kiri's lab now, but she told me to wait until I have all three ingredients for the Orpheus method. Bien. 
Entonces. Conseguir la llave está. La pluma de Fénix. Uf. Encontrar el hilo de la vida roto de Tristán. Hay que entrar en el jardín. Para eso. Que es donde ella tira todos los hilos rotos. Bueno, cortados. Buscar el alma de Tristán. Pues solo me queda ahora mismo el jardín y apagar el fuego. Y me imagino que la gatera tendrá algo que ver. you again. What shenanigans are you up to this time? Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Ugh. Vuelve a mear, no sé por qué. No tiene sentido que se me. Con la arena, sí. O con la no arena. Kitty, 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 kitty. <risa> Se mira. <risa> pues no sé. A ver. No sé qué hacer. No. I... No. Well, it's not a prim flap. I need your help, little eye. You have ah, mira. to and find Tristan's life thread. Esto no lo intenté antes y me dijo que no. Ajá. Tiene una carta. Novillo. Juego de gnomos. El objetivo es cruzar la puerta con el ovillo antes de que te pille el gato. Bien, el, el gnomo hay que usarlo como, como pared, ¿no? Ah, no. Ah, puedo mover el gnomo. ¡Ey! El gato se mueve dos... Se mueve dos, dos puntos. Claro que así llega. Muevo aquí. Da igual lo que haga. Ese me quedará pegado. Entonces lo que voy a hacer es moverlo aquí.
You made it! You're the best! Just like Kiri said, there's one thread that sticks out. Tristan's life thread. I'm going to pluck it out. Here it is! Tristan, your life wasn't supposed to end like this. This is all my fault. But I can make it right. Hmm. What do I do with the ball of wool now? Here, my little spider eye. You can keep it. Solo queda apagar el fuego. Yo creo que aquí he terminado. No veo nada aquí que no que no me haya llevado, que no haya mirado. aquí Ah, se lo da a diferentes cabezas. Bien, ¿será ese el truco que hay que dárselo a las tres cabezas? Oh no. Pues no. No sé qué hacer para que venga. Not a good idea. Nope. No. I can't use my new ventriloquism skills on that. I can't use my new... I'd really love to get myself a salad, but then again, I don't want to eat my friends. Oh, friends, stop that! Hank, have you been gaining weight? My branch hurts! Spruce, is that you? De alguna manera, tengo que poder llegar a esa carta o tirar la carta. No, I... No. 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 Pues no sé qué hacer. No. That doesn't make sense. Nope. Oh. Not a good. I don't want to do the mold. I've already discovered Hank's secret. I found a book about it in the tree. Nothing. There seems. <sighs> I don't. <sighs> Not. 
Este, este ya lo hemos visto. Hank was right. Persephone was messing with the tree by oh, letting a cat pee on it. The poor dog just wants to mark his territory again. No. Vale, me falta la moneda también. Ah, mira, una carta. ¿Cuántas tengo ya? Eh, ¿Las cartas dónde están? Ah, están aquí. Cuatro, cinco, siete, ocho. Claro, pero algo me dice que las cartas que tengo no son las más fuertes. Ni siquiera sé jugar. Todavía. Ahora tengo que añadirlas todas. Pero tengo que añadir... La estaba mirando... No serán las más fuertes, pero bueno, por lo menos de esta manera quizá pueda aprender a jugar. la rana en todo esto, por ejemplo. Nod Logs Lane. Wait, is this the name of a street? La catapulta ya no se puede usar. Now the only thing left is the note. Vale, voy a jugar a hacer una partida, a ver cómo se juega. Porque... Esto tiene cuatro números. Pues inteligencia. Peso. No sé lo que es. Ahora supongo que me lo explicará. I will say this only once, so I will be very clear. Do not question my authority in front of the child ever again! I didn't mean to question anyone's authority. It's just that 
Well, this whole parenting thing is new to you. I thought you might want someone by your side who can offer a fresh perspective on things. And what exactly qualifies you for this? I was our father's daughter. <laughs> can I have that casketball card over there? Defeat me in a game of casketball cards, and it shall be yours. Have you collected at least eight cards? You need them for a competitive deck, you know. Yes, I have. Do you want to play? Yes. Okay, here we go. Pues sí, pero tengo que usar esa carta Pues en esta inteligencia De aquí peso o fuerza. Pierdo. ¿Qué están ordenadas al azar o cómo es esto? Gana el que menos, el porcentaje gana el que menos tiene. Me va a ganar en todas, eh. No lo entiendo. A ver, se supone que esta la debería ganar yo. Se la ha dado a él, ¿por qué? Esto es velocidad. No lo entiendo. Pero que me está haciendo trampa, ¿eh? Velocidad. Se supone que gano yo. Ahí sí. Vale, ahí está claro. Esto es el, el que menos porcentaje tenga, gana. Y parece que en la velocidad también, el que sea más lento, gana. No sé por qué. Ah, pierdo otra vez. Y aquí pierdo. As expected, death remains undefeated. Oh, I didn't count. <sighs> Many beings in my realm play this game, Prim. Go challenge them, for they will give you cards to improve your deck if you defeat them. Then, you may return and challenge me again. Ay, no, no iba a ser tan fácil. Vale, ya que estoy aquí, me va a volver a decir que no quiere bajar por el pozo. Theoretically, I could descend into the. Vale, y si uso, no sé, el gnomo de jardín, no.
No creo que se pueda usar con tan atos el ojo, ¿verdad? It's the same thing every time I offer my help. The Grim Reaper must do everything alone and can't share an ounce of responsibility. Brother, you're overworked and stressed out, and your relationship with your daughter is suffering because of it. If only you'd let me take on some responsibility too. I can help. I have ideas. I... Enough. I will not rely on anyone else to fulfill my task. Especially not you. Your damaged memory makes that impossible. The sooner you understand this, the better for both of us. <sighs> If you change your mind, you know where to find me. I don't think Kiris has a secret worth discovering. Ah, bueno, sí que funcionó antes. ¿Dónde va? I've been inside the old man's mind once, and I really don't want to do it again. Pues nada, no sé. No sé qué me deja otra. Sé que la clave está aquí. Pero no se me ocurre qué. Y tiene que ver con el pienso para topos y con el frasco de pis de gato. Nope. The Moly Grail. Treat your beloved subterranean dweller to our new improved formula. Pomegranate flavor. What can you do with flowers again? Give me a withered one, and I'll bring it back to life in no time. I know what you did with the cat. I still have no idea what you're talking about, young lady. Bye, Persephone. Hang loose. Oh, never heard that one before. I should write that one down, should I? Pues si vuelvo a entrar otra vez en el jardín. También aquí hay pintura y un rodillo. ¿Por qué? Ah, espérate, el gnomo tiene la, la parte de arriba blanca. Puede ser... The garden gnome's cap is white now. Vale, ¿para qué? His hat is white, but the nose is pointy. Mm. These two don't fit together. I shouldn't randomly try to combine stuff. I could pull the cork out with this, but I don't need a screaming shrunken head shredding my nerves right now. Tiene que tener la nariz redonda. From now on, I'm only going to play death metal. Pardon? <laughs> Ah, 
pala impecable, pala muy sucia. Me sale como un lugar, pero... Ah, esto es más información de... De a quién pertenece, del lugar que le gusta a cada uno. Esto ya lo sabíamos. Así que esto no nos dice nada. Una patata. Ah, una patata es lo que va a ir en la nariz. Y esta es la flor que hay que darle a Perséfone para que la, la reviva. Y ya está. Sí, no creo que el ovillo ya no sirva de nada. Ya tenemos el hilo que queríamos. What have you got there? A potato. Um, thank you, I guess. And a dead flower. Charming. It suits him, if you ask me. <laughs> Bastante horroroso, verdad? Let me see. Yes, this looks just right. Give it to me. I'll place it on my board. It'll also appear in Lackey Love Three's garden now, only bigger. Bien, para qué? There was no gnome, and now there's a new gnome, a well-known gnome. There's no gnome like my gnome. Now say that fast three times in a row. Para qué? Se supone que ahora en el jardín hay dos gnomos. Well, it's not a prim flap. ¿Qué gano con esto? Nada. Yo creo que a lo mejor en el juego, si aparecen dos gnomos, claro, es más fácil. Pero ahora... Ahora no sirve de nada. Bien, ahora lo que puedo hacer es darle la flor. Persephone, can you revitalize this herb for me? What a question! Give me the poor fellow. Oh, he says he's been treated very badly. Yeah, the garden where I found him was pretty neglected. Oh, must be the fates. Only one of them really likes being in the garden, but I don't remember which. Anyway, let's breathe a little life into him, shall we? I don't think it's working. Why not? It seems he's been dead too long already. I'm sorry, but I can't work wonders. I guess you'll have to stay dead, flowery friend. Huh? What happened? I... I think I... saved the flower. He's alive! Amazing! How did you do that? I... I have no idea. You're full of surprises, little Miss Reaper. It's the herb from the Fates Garden. It's alive again now, but I have no idea what it does. Bien, vamos a volver a la casa y a mirar en el libro de herboristería. <risa> Ella acaba de revivir una planta. Será así como va a revivir a Tristán. 
¿Va a ser ella la que la reviva? Oh, it feels strange being back in my room. The last time I was here, Tristan was still alive. I wonder if this brick of a book can help me again. Bien, a ver. La planta es gris, circular, rizada. Hydration. Infused with the spirit of the swift-footed messenger god, this herb is a celestial elixir for the bladder, delivering divine relief. Yeah. O sea. Hermes Hydration. Infused with the spirit of the swift-footed messenger god, this herb is a celestial elixir for the bladder, delivering divine relief. ¿Y para quién es esto? Va a ser para... Bueno, espera, espera. No creo que sea para ella. Va a ser para Perséfone. O oh, para el perro. I'm sure this would ah. make him relieve himself, but he doesn't want to eat it. Bien. Si mezclo con el pienso de topo la planta. This will make it even tastier. Por eso no quería hacer pis. That dog finally going to do his business. What if I could help him? Oh, I would love that. Please don't. We know what that beast is up to, Spruce. Run. Bien, lo tenemos. It all made sense in the end. That was the last bit of mole food I had. Too bad, I thought I might try it too. I'll throw the package away. Me queda saber cómo conseguir la carta. A ver, ¿puedo jugar de esta manera? ¿Puedo jugar con la gente? How about a round of casketball cards? Me and Spruce, we never say no to a Ajá. casketball cards. Esa carta es, hay que ganarla. Pifia, ah, por eso el menor gana. Pero no entiendo por qué la velocidad el menor gana. Eh... Este. Uf. Fuerza. Uh, pierdo. Ahí pierdo. También pierdo. La velocidad debería ser el más veloz, pero no entiendo por qué es el menor, el, el menos veloz. Inteligencia, pierdo. Pierdo otra vez. Es que mis cartas son muy malas, ¿eh? Ah! 
We won that game fair and square. Yeehaw! <laughs> I have a feeling my deck is too weak to beat you. But I, but I... Always complaining, <laughs> huh? You know what? You should play against Lachesis the Fate. She's supposed to be quite bad at... Vale, pues vamos. As bad as you, of course. Vamos a jugar con las Moiras, pero primero... A ver, el huevo de... Eh, de Fénix, que está por aquí. Finally. I got the Phoenix egg. But I need Phoenix feathers. What do I do now? Ya leímos que hay que hay que hacer que crezca y que, que se convierta en, en adulto. Pero no sé cómo. How do I make it hatch? Voy a jugar con con la Kesis primero. How about a round of basketball cards? Of course, Flower. A ver si es verdad que es tan mala. A ver, de aquí. Fuerza. De aquí... Inteligencia. No, pierdo. Inteligencia... Aquí también pierdo. También. <ríe> ya verás que voy a perder incluso con la peor. Voy a perder. Porcentaje, también pierdo. <ríe> Ahí gano. Eh... También gano. Eh, voy a probar con fuerza. Pierdo. Y vuelvo a perder. Se supone que, que es mala jugando. How about a round of basketball cards? Oh. Vamos a probar otra vez. Este... Pifia. También gano. Este... Velocidad. Uf, por poco... Por poco gano, ¿eh? Pero me gano. Es como si supiera mis cartas. Bueno. Eh, aquí qué. Fuerza. Aquí 
inteligencia. No. Tiene muchas cartas de inteligencia Bastante alta No sé si todas las cartas están en el mismo orden Porque si es así solo hace falta Copiarlas Sería más fácil De aquí Fuerza Empiezo perdiendo Uh, por uno Voy a poner velocidad, aunque inteligencia no está mal. Velocidad. Y aquí... Uf, no sé. Fuerza. No. Tenía, tenía que haber puesto velocidad. Ahora saca todas las de inteligencia que son superiores a las que yo tengo y ya está. Y gana otra vez. Y te que seguir avanzando y conseguir más cartas. Venga, una última vez. A ver, aquí... Inteligencia, porque esto es muy alto, esto es muy bajo y esto es más o menos alto. De aquí, velocidad. De aquí, también velocidad. De aquí. No sé. Inteligencia no está mal, velocidad no está mal. De aquí... Velocidad. Ah. También velocidad. De aquí... Inteligencia. Bien. Una más. Y de aquí... Velocidad. Gano. 
La primera vez que gano una partida. <risa> Me da una carta. Oh, that was cosmic, Prim. I'd like to give you this. Thank you, Lackey. Uh, no está mal de fuerza y no está mal de inteligencia. Y esto es también muy bajo. Una muy, muy buena carta, ¿eh? ¿Cuál puedo quitar? Esta, por ejemplo, no es muy buena. La velocidad es alta, eh, la fuerza es muy baja. Sí, esto también es muy bajo, no está mal. Este, este lo voy a quitar. Y le voy a añadir... ¿Dónde está? ¿Servirá también con las demás hermanas? She had summoned the inescapable thread cutter again. How about a round of casketball cards? Atropos told Prim she did not play that game, but Lachesis, her sister, did. Solo la que sí es la que juega. Así que nada. ¿Y este? I challenge you to a game of casketball cards. No, sorry. I don't play that game. I play game of gnomes. ¿Quién más? How about a round of casketball cards? Definitely. That game is one of the best things about this world. A ver, Persephone, si tiene buenas cartas o no. mala, ¿eh? Uh, por 0,1 Y ganó Well done, little princess. Here, you deserve this. Thanks, Persephone. Eh, no está mal de velocidad y no está mal de pifia y de inteligencia también. Está, está muy bien esta carta. En todo. Y qué quito.
este. Bien, eh, es, iba a ir a, a, sí, a la casa de Thanatos a leer el libro otra vez. A ver si me dice algo sobre el huevo de, de Fénix. ¿Dónde estaba eso? Aquí. No dice el cómo. Dice que hay que criarlo, pero no dice cómo. Surge de la ceniza de su muerte, pero eso ya lo ha hecho. ¿Qué me queda por hacer? Por ejemplo, el, el pozo. Y no sé qué más. I'm sure this won't help the Phoenix hatch. Theoretically, I could descend into the well like this. Nada, y si se lo doy a la gallina zombie esta para que lo empolle a lo mejor. I wonder if she'll... Sí, va a ser eso. Eso. Yes. Good to have a mom, isn't it? But how long does it take for a phoenix chick to hatch? Oh, that was quick. I hate to do this, but I have to. Hello, mother hen. I hope you don't mind if I just. Sí, sí que le importa. Hey, you do mind, obviously. What now? Bueno, hay que echar al pollo de alguna manera. There's no need for unbearably loud unhinged screaming here. Here, chiki 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 chiki. Let's pretend I never said that. <laughs> hey, it worked. Wait, what? Ahí está. Por eso hay que bajar al pozo. And it's gone again, just my luck. Hey, déjà vu. Okay, Prim, no time to chicken out. No offense, feathery friend. Baby Phoenix, I'm coming to save you. Oh, yes, eh? What a nice voice. It's too far away for me to reach it. Pero si está la piedra ahí es por algo. Nope. No. Such an interesting day. Wait, what? First, that tiny white thing falls down, and now, how peculiar, a bucket with a face. Hey, um, I'm not a bucket. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm kidding, silly. It's just that I'm not used to having visitors. I... I thought I heard you singing on my way down. Oh, that croaking? No, no, it was beautiful. Why, thank you. It means a lot coming from... A bucket with a face. <laughs> oh, how impolite of me. I'm Medi. I'm Prim. What a beautiful name. Oh, thank you. I think I recognize your voice. Was that you up there talking to yourself for two minutes straight? Um, no, no. Who would do that? <laughs> I'm sure that was you. You live down here? No, I don't. I mean, who'd choose to live in such a stink hole? I got kind of grounded. Oh, I can relate. I was just grounded, too. My fa Thanatos locked me up for a whole night. <laughs> How long have you been trapped here? Hmm, 30 years? Maybe 35? Who's counting, right? Yeah, who's counting? Uh, wait. How old are you? Older than I look, that's for sure. Time works in strange ways down here, so I don't seem to age. What could you possibly have done to deserve something like this? I used to be a proud priestess of Athena. Is that the woman in the painting over there? Woman? <laughs> She's a goddess. Isn't she beautiful? But I fell out of favor and she punished me. Es Medusa. And I've tried everything I can think of to make her forgive me. I even saw her punishment as a gift. I embraced it, but it only brought me here. Oh, that sounds pretty sad. I was brought here against my will, too. Seems like we're both misunderstood, Prim. Girls like us have to stick together. Viendo el cuadro de el cuadro este, viendo a la gente convertida en piedra y que se llama Medi. Esta chica es Medusa. Cosa blanca debe ser mi huevo de fénix. ¿Sabe dónde está? That white thing must have been my phoenix egg. Do you know where it is? I think it hatched and then hid somewhere around here. It hatched? That's so cool. But how do I find it now? Well, I could help. Nobody knows this place better than I do. You do that? Great! But I simply can't. Just look at me. Ugh. I have to finish my morning routine first. Your what? My morning routine. Every girl should have one. Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> Nothing too fancy. Brush your hair with five strokes, then shampoo, conditioner, towel dry, brush another five strokes, a little spray here, and a drop of tincture there, repeat it all three more times, and before you know it, you're all set for the day. Simple as that. Simple as that! Your hair looks gorgeous, by the way. I can see it in the mirror. Really? I mean, thank you! How do you make it swirl like that? I literally woke up like this. Oh, enviable. ¿Y por qué no termina ya tu rutina de belleza? So, why don't you just finish your morning routine? I can't. My favorite brush is gone. It's the only thing that can tame my unmanageable curls. My dear sister took it from me. Well, then I'll just find your sister and ask her to give it back. Oh, you do that for me? Sure. I've done weirder things for strangers today. But, no, it's too dangerous. Dangerous? Why? Well, the thing is, my sister might be the river monster. Your sister is the... The river monster, yes. Jeans, right? Who knows what'll get passed down? I always thought she took after her mother. She'll never give the brush to me or you or anybody else. So it's hopeless. Not entirely, no. You look like you have a trick or two up your sleeve. I do? I, I mean, I do. If you can find my sister, I'm sure you can get the brush somehow. 
But you'll need this whistle. What whistle? Look in your pocket. How did you... I've got a trick or two up my sleeve as well. <laughs> I won't let you down, Medi. Good luck, Bucket Girl. I have to go now, Medi. Come back soon, Prim. Please? I will. Bye, Athena. What an interesting day. Oh, Medi gave it to me. She said I'd need it to get her brush from her sister, the river monster? Vale, pero ¿dónde estará? En este río. That doesn't make sense. Oh, Mary gave Pues no. That doesn't make sense. Kiri's told me its name. I think it was Styx. It's where the souls that can't be the ferryman end up. Quizá este donde donde estaba el el castor. un arroyo, no un río, así que no, no aquí no va a ser. No. Nope. No está aquí. Y si está al otro lado, nos queda por hacer buscar el alma de Tristán. Para eso hay que darle la moneda a Caronte, al barquero. A lo mejor. Hey, hey, you. I need to talk to you. It's a lo mejor está en el otro lado. Place your number on me. Oh, it's you again. Yes, it's me again. I want a bargain. Isn't there anything I can offer you in return for passage? Mm, esto es nuevo. I indeed have a weakness for a good trade now and then. What gave me away? The distinguished aura of an experienced collector? No. I think it was the massive mound of trash piled up next to your boat over there. Oh, I see. So, what would you like to trade in exchange for a river crossing? Ah, por esta, esta montaña la ha creado Caronte. El, ar el aracnóculo no lo va a dar, ¿no? Do you want a spider eye that can show you people's secrets? Uh, what? I'm just kidding, little friend. Eso. I'd never give you away. La guadaña. What do you think of this fine Swiss pocket scythe? I don't want that. No la quiere. El saca corchos. More or less functioning corkscrew is to die for. No, tampoco lo quiere. La cabeza reducida que no para de chillar. Wouldn't it be great to have a shrunken head that never stops screaming? That's not the least bit interesting to me. El libro de ventriloquía. Surely you want this book on ventriloquism. I'm not interested. Tampoco. El despertador, uno de los despertadores. An unusual alarm clock, maybe? Who would want that? Pues no tengo nada. I don't think I have anything you'd want right now. 
how can I find out what he's into? Pues con el aracnóculo. I don't sense a secret here. There seems to be nothing to uncover. I don't sense a secret here. <sighs> Not the slightest trace of an interesting secret here. Aquí. Se me había olvidado eso. ¿Qué son cartas? Son cartas del juego. Wait. Is that a collection of Casketball trading cards? But it looks like one card is missing. Se rumorea que eres todo un experto en las cartas coleccionables más selectas. Rumor has it that you're a connoisseur of exquisite trading cards? That is absolutely ridiculous. I am the Dark Ferryman, carrier of souls. I don't have time for such childish nonsense. Oh, okay, my bad. Then I should talk to somebody else about this one very, very, very rare casketball card. Um, I, I, what card do you mean? Oh, you wouldn't know about it anyway. It's only of interest to collectors. But you're, you're not talking about the... About what? The ultra rare Firefox card limited edition with holographic radiance and this printed strength value. So you are a collector. Shh, not so loud. It doesn't suit the dark fairyman to be interested in such things. Well, I think everybody has a guilty pleasure. Mine was pimple popping. Man, did I pop those pimples? But I don't get them anymore since coming here. My face is too bony. So. The Firefox card. Hmm, what about it? Do you have it? Not yet, but I think I know where it is. If I get it for you, you have to take me across the river. Deal? Deal. Es la carta que tiene Thanatos, que hay que ganarle. Bien, pues lo que necesito es una, un buen mazo de cartas. Voy a... A ver, aquí. Con quien no he... No he jugado y no le he ganado. Es con Tanato y con su hermana tampoco. Así que vamos a ver. Aquí está, ¿qué eres? How about a round of casketball cards? Hmm. I think one round couldn't hurt, right? Eh, uf, esta no es muy buena Rafael, esta carta me la quiero quitar La carta es malísima, eh Hubiera perdido en todo Da igual lo que hubiera elegido, hubiera perdido Mira, una que ganó. Creía que las iba a perder todas. Eh, de aquí que... Oh, pierdo. A ella no le voy a ganar. Nunca le ganaré con las cartas que tengo. Ah, Rafael, esta carta es horrorosa. Ah, 
pierdo. Vale, Keres tiene un, ma un mazo de cartas muy bueno. You need some more practice, casket nail. Yeah. Vale, creo que tengo que volver a retar a los demás para conseguir más cartas. Yo pensaba que había que retar a cada uno una vez. Cada uno te daba una carta y ya no podías hacerlo, pero creo que no va a ser así. Yo creo que puedes retarle más veces y te siguen dando cartas hasta crearte un mazo decente. Ganar a Keres y luego a Thanatos. Vamos a ir, por ejemplo, contra Hank. I challenge you to a game of basketball cards. Me and Spruce, we never say no to a game of basketball cards. Uf, la, la peor carta que tengo. Los empates seguidos. Eh, de aquí que inteligencia. Son la misma carta, otro empate. De aquí. Velocidad. Ahora entiendo por qué el más bajo. Sí, ahora voy. El más bajo gana porque son eh, a los 100 metros. O sea, ¿cuánto tiempo tardas en hacer 100 metros? Cuanto menos tarde, más rápido va. Ah, gato. No está mal en, en todo, ¿eh? We won that game fair and square. Yeehaw! <laughs> Gosh, I'm sick of playing that stupid game. You know what? I'm gonna go to Thanatos and stick to my guns until he gives me that special card. No te la va a dar. Hay que ganarle. Vale, vamos a probar con Persephone. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Definitely. That game is one of the best things about this world. Ah, 
La peor carta que tengo. Well done, little princess. You should challenge the old grumpy sack of bones over there next. With an improved deck, I'm sure you will absolutely humiliate him. Here, you deserve this. Exacto. Ahí está, te dan más cartas. Esta es buena. Esta es muy buena. Y quiero quitarme de encima a... Rafael. Y poner a... Jens. Jens en cuanto a pifia es muy buena y en cuanto a peso, fuerza también. Vale, vamos a probar ahora con, con Hank otra vez. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Me and Spruce, we never say no to a game of basketball cards. Hey, que este es otro que también me quiero quitar Horrible en pifia Horrible en fuerza Un poquito bueno en inteligencia Y de este Fuerza y aquí inteligencia De aquí O inteligencia o pifia Inteligencia También inteligencia De aquí pifia Esta es la que acabo la que acabo de poner en el mazo, la nueva. Y, tam y este podría ser... Oh, es que esta es muy buena. ¿eh? Podría ser cualquiera, realmente. Oh, nuts. We lost that one. Enjoy that win now. There you go. Thanks, Hank. Mm, no está mal No está nada mal En inteligencia En pifia En todo Vale, ¿cuál quito? Matías Y quito Lake Quito Lake Mira, hay alguna que no sea muy buena Pixel es muy bueno en inteligencia. Alice también en inteligencia. Que realmente Alice, Avery y Pixel no están mal, pero tampoco están del todo bien. 
Y las demás cartas están muy bien. Bueno, voy a probar con este mazo. Quizá esas cartas que no están del todo bien me las puede dar Eres. Si le gano un par de veces. Hay basketball cards with me? Hmm. I think one round couldn't hurt, right? Uf, ves, esta es una de las buenas. Uf, casi pierdo, ¿eh? Porque esta también es muy buena, ¿eh? Hubiera perdido en inteligencia, en velocidad y hubiera ganado en esta dos. En peso y en pifia. Esto es pifia. Es muy bajo. Creo que es el más bajo que hay. También es muy bueno, ¿eh? Esta es una de las que podría quitarme de encima. Pierdo. Ah, voy a perder. A no ser que saliera la misma, perdería. Ah, venga ya. 16% no es tan bueno y he perdido. Bien. A ver si puedo remontar. Empate. Y aquí, fuerza. Oh no, aquí pifia. Empate. De aquí, inteligencia. De aquí, uh, complicado, porque esta es buena. Eh, inteligencia. Si hubiera elegido pifia, hubiéramos empatado. Esta es una carta mala. Pero gano, bien. Venga, una más. Ah, no, no, ya está. Bien, a ver, dame una buena carta. Wow, no bad, Prim. Here, take this. Cool. Thank you, Carries. No está nada mal. Tom. Tom, y quito. ¿Cuál quito? Alice. No, Alice. Pongo Tom. Voy a probar otra vez con Keres. Y si le gano y me da una buena carta, ya pruebo con Tanatos. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Hmm. I think one round couldn't hurt, right? <risa> Inteligencia. <risa> Inteligencia. También inteligencia. Y 
de aquí, ¿ves? Esta es una de las que no son muy allá. No está mal. De aquí, pifia. Pierdo. Tenía que haber elegido inteligencia. Gano. Esta es otra de las que no son tan buenas. Fuerza. Empate. De aquí, fuerza. De aquí, pifia. Fuerza. Venga, una más. Inteligencia. Y gano. Wow. Not bad, Prim. I think you should try to sí. get your father now, Cassie. Ahora pruebo con Thanatos. To include new cards in your deck first. Here, take this. Cool. Thank you, Carries. Sasha, no está nada mal. ¿Qué quito de aquí? Voy a quitar a Avery. Sí. Sí. Voy a quitar a Avery. Y Sasha, ¿dónde estás? Pixel lo he dejado por la inteligencia. Pero bueno, también podría jugar otra vez con... Con Keres. Y quitar de aquí Pixel. Por una carta buena. Pero bueno, voy a probar. A lo mejor se puede ya. Voy a probar con Thanatos. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Death accepts your challenge. Inteligencia. Inteligencia. Ah, pierdo. Es que la de Sasha es muy buena. Y esta también es muy buena. Ah, me las voy a perder todas. Voy a perderlas todas. Uf, tiene un mazo muy, muy bueno. As expected, death remains undefeated. Oh, I didn't go. <sighs> hmm. Maybe I should improve my deck by beating weaker players first? A ver si quieres me da una carta para quitar alguna que tengo mala. Me? Hmm. I think one round couldn't hurt, right? ¿Ves? Por ejemplo, esta no está tan mal. Solo es buena en inteligencia. Y, y, y a veces pierde. Así que esa me la podría quitar. Y 
Y esta también me la podría quitar. Raymond es peor. muy parecido al de Keres. No estamos al nivel de Thanatos todavía. A ver qué carta me da. Wow, not bad, Prim. I think you should try to beat your father now, Casket Nail. But don't forget to include new cards in your deck first. Here, take this. Cool. Thank you, Carries. Cody, esta no la tengo. Esta la tengo ya, verdad? Tema viene de fuerza, solo fuerza. Pixel es más bien de inteligencia. Voy a quitar Raymond y voy a añadir Cody. No es tan buena carta, es muy buena en fuerza y ya está. Los demás no... No es tan buena carta. Vale, vamos a probar. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Death accepts your challenge. Y pierdo, es que esta carta no está, es la peor que tengo en el mazo. Ah, 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 ah,
Sustituir la que tengo ahí, débil. Esta de pixel. Sí, es la única que es un poquito más débil. Es bastante buena en inteligencia, pero es que... Excepto Cody... Cody y James. Las demás son mejores incluso en inteligencia que esta. No, no me vale. Hay que quitar pixel y poner algo interesante. Hay una carta que tiene este. Está muy bien. Would you like to play basketball cards with me? Hmm. I think one round couldn't hurt, right? Would you like to play cat? Mm. Jens en nada. La carta contra esta nada. Ah, 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 ah,
seguida es la misma carta. Uf. Creo que estoy teniendo mala suerte, ¿eh? Porque las cartas que tengo son buenas. encima. Vida perdido en todo. una buena carta. No está mal en pifia y ya está. Comparado con Pixel... Es mejor en peso y sobre todo en pifia. Y este es mejor en inteligencia, pero yo tengo un montón de cartas y ya son mejores en inteligencia. Voy a quitar Pixel y voy a poner Amanda. Aunque no creo que mejore mucho, porque esta carta tampoco está tan bien. Would you like to play Death? Solo en velocidad. Hay en fuerza. Esa es la buena. Esa es la que yo quiero. Ah, no. 
You played well, Prim. I found our game to be enjoyable. Okay, this is getting too weird. I have to go. Hey, brother. Why are you still so grumpy? She's playing with you. If that's not real progress, I don't know what is. You are short-sighted as always, Curies. I suspect you played not for the love of playing, but with the express intention of winning that card. Can you blame her? What for? For not wanting to spend time with you. I mean, have you ever shown any real interest in what she likes? She is a teenager. She likes nothing. Do you remember when Father presented you with your very first black robe? It is ironic that you should lecture me about remembering things. Do you remember or not? I hated it. I wanted a new bathing suit. I was swimming in the Acheron every night, but Father never noticed. Exactly. Where are you going? Research. A investigar qué? Oh no, I hope he doesn't find out about our plan. Okay, so I have this shiny card, but what now? Esta. Es de las mejores cartas, si no la mejor. Es buena en todo. No es la mejor en todo. Pero sí que es muy buena en todo. Bueno, pero esta carta da igual porque hay que dársela a Caronte. Creo que tengo una carta de baloncéretro que podría interesarte. I think I have a basketball card that might interest you. This is it. The ultra rare Firefox card limited edition with holographic radiance and misprinted strength value. Have you ever seen anything so beautiful? Took me a bit to win it, actually. I'm sure it'll make your deck unbeatable. My deck? <clears throat> no, no. I don't play with cards. I collect them. I vacuum seal them in protective sleeves and display them in my showcase. And there they stay, so I can enjoy them every day. And I thought Thanatos was strange. Oh, and before I forget, Take this regular Firefox card. Ah, mira. Your deck would surely look naked without it. Thank you. So, are you taking me across the river or what? Well, yeah, sure. Jump into the little boat behind my hut when you're ready to go. O sea, me da la. Me devuelve. ¿Dónde estás? Aquí está. Me devuelve la misma carta. Pero si los fallos esos de impresión y todo eso que ha dicho, entonces, de aquí... Podría quitar... Claro, es que no tengo... No tengo ninguna que sea mala ahora mismo. Y 
Empieza a quitar a Cody. Es muy buena solo en, en fuerza. Pero solo, solo es 248 frente a 241. Y en lo demás gana Firefox, está claro. Entonces Cody la puedo quitar. Y se queda un mazo bastante bueno. Pero bueno, no creo que vuelva a jugar. Bien, subir a la barca. I'm ready. Let's get going. Perfect. I'll be there in a second. Would you mind if I slip into something more comfortable? I just find it difficult to roll with my robe on. Suit yourself. Ah, much better. Okay, I didn't expect <laughs> that. Yeah, I know. You know, most people find my true self kind of... underwhelming. Oh, no, not at all. I was just... surprised. How old are you? Actually, I'm as old as the river, which is pretty old. But I don't age. I've always been like this. And why do you dress up like that big guy? That's what people expect when they hear the dark ferryman, not some little squirt. I don't know. I think the little squirt suits you much better. Oh, thank you. Oh, the limited edition with extra glow? I still can't believe it. The guys on the forum will be so jealous. Everybody needs a hobby, I guess. I know it must sound stupid to you. Like most of our underworld customs, I suppose. Actually, it's not all so bad. Oh, really? What about you, Miss Reaper? What floats your boat? You mean, like a hobby? Yep. Eh, no sé, no, mm, creo que no tengo ninguna afición. Me gusta mucho no contestar preguntas demasiado personales a desconocidos. I don't know. I don't think I have a hobby. Nothing? You can't be serious. Everybody likes something. Well, I thought I'd try photography. My mother loved it. Uh, the art of capturing precious moments. Making them immortal. Never been much of a photo guy myself. But good pictures take skill, and I respect that. What do you want to take photos of, huh? Cool ghouls? Yummy mummies, huh? Oh, I can't take photos of anything. I had a camera, but it broke. Oh, sorry to hear that. Getting a new one down here won't be easy, I'm afraid. Um... What's that sound? It's the soul. What are they whispering? Their last words. That's all they can say apart from the names. Feel free to listen. Sometimes it's quite interesting. No creo que Tristan sea ninguna de estas. I don't think it's poisonous. Please don't leave me. 
I'll finally get to see Mother again. I'm not scared. I'm scared. ¿Cuántas veces hay que hacer esto? Porque no se puede avanzar, ¿no? Curtain call. Take a bow. Roaring applause. Standing ovations. The play is over. What a night. We had a good run. So, do we just float around a while and then go back? No, actually, um, Karan, I need to tell you a secret, but you have to promise me not to tell Thanatos. If I had lips, they'd be sealed. I'm looking for a soul. He's a friend of mine. I need to find him and take him with me. Oh, okay, that's a uh, unusual request. Technically, it's not forbidden, you know? It's just that usually nobody really cares about the lost souls. But can you find him? Me? No, but I know someone who can. Prim, I'll take you to the river monster. Aquí está. La, la hermana de la que está en el pozo de... Ay, de la gorgona que está en el pozo. That doesn't sound too good. No, she's really okay. A little over enthusiastic, maybe? But you'll understand when you meet her. Her name's Bella. Okay. The River Styx Ballet Ensemble invites you to a night of marriage, mystery, and mischief. And here she is! Come on, guys, stop! No, 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 no! Oh, I wish I could get their attention somehow. Mm, el silbato. Come on, people, enough milling around now! Lo que quieres es el silbato. Stop it. Excuse me. I darling, can't you see I'm busy right now? Getting these souls organized is like herding cats. Would you please calm down now, guys? My whistle, you brought it back. Now, I can finally get these troublemakers under control. You heard the blast, guys. Time to relax. Ah, oh, at last. Sweet, sweet silence. Don't get me wrong, these souls really deserve some free play after ballet class. But I guess there can be too much of anything, even of good things, right? If you say so. I'm Uriley, by the way. But you can call me Bella. Hi, Bella. I'm Prim. Oh, and hi, Caron. Bella, I missed you at spin class on Thursday. Yeah, you know, I just I wasn't feeling well. Oh, what a shame. But you don't look sick to me now. I got better, you know, the spectral stew did the trick. That's great. See you Thursday, then. Mm -hmm. Oh, I met your sister in the well. I know, I must have dropped my whistle when I last saw her. Thank you for returning it, by the way. So, let me guess. Maddie was real nice to you and sent you on a tiny fetch quest to get her brush? Am I right? How did you...? Because I know my sister. She'd do anything to escape the prison I put her in. Wait, you locked her up down there? Together with Athena and the Fates. Believe me, it was the hardest thing I ever did. But it had to be done. I visit her as much as I can. And she will be freed eventually, but not yet. She still doesn't see what she did was wrong. She keeps telling herself she did it all for Athena. What did she do? Look, I just met you and I don't want to air our whole family's dirty laundry in front of you. Please understand. Okay. I'll only say this. If you ever encounter my sister in the wild, make sure to close your eyes as fast as you can. How cryptic. So, 
I guess I'm not getting the brush. Did you hear what I just said? <sighs> okay, okay. Shoot. Oh, pues no me lo va a dar. Así que tú eres el monstruo del río, ¿no? So, you're the river monster, huh? That's what they call me these days. Flattering, isn't it? But don't you worry about me. I suppose, in the cold light of day, the nickname isn't too far-fetched after all, right? But I have to stay true to what I always tell the guys at my body positivity class. Embrace yourself. Dare to be unique and different. Take me. I'm an entertainer. I love to cheer people up. That's one thing I love about myself. What do you love about yourself, Prim? I don't know. I don't think I really love anything. That can't be true. I'm sure you'll find something. Bueno, bailarina, ¿qué es todo esto? Dancing hands? What is all this? Oh, that's just our ballet group. Yeah, but shouldn't these lost souls be moaning in great pain and floating around in the river aimlessly? That's the point, don't you see? These poor souls simply have nothing to do. Nothing. For like, ever. So you teach them ballet? Ballet, pottery, creative writing, anything really, as long as it makes eternity seem a bit less, well, eternal. You know, I think of myself as a kind of social worker. I swim around in the river and just ask them what they would like. And if I can, I make it happen. But they can't talk. Can they? So what? Talking is overrated. Art is the language of the heart. Estoy buscando el alma de un amigo. ¿Me ayudas a encontrarla? I'm looking for the soul of a friend. Can you help me find it? Sure. Tell me about your friend. Well, his name is Tristan. Uh huh. Would you mind being a little more specific, dear? He's terribly afraid of cockroaches and thinks they're part of a secret society ruling the world from underground. He eats cereal with juice, which is disgusting, and he bites his toenails. <gasps> Oops, that last one was a secret I wasn't supposed to tell. You were pretty close, am I right? He was, uh, he is my best friend. Hmm, let me think. Pretty skinny guy, all arms and legs, dark hair, broken glasses. That's him! Yep. I know the one. Just arrived here not long ago. He was still pretty much clinging to his life and didn't want to participate in any of my activities. But I think I know where to find him. Give me just a sec, I'll call him. Nanny's brush. It's in Bella's fanny pack. Found him? Wow, <laughs> that was fast. <gasps> Tristan. Don't be disappointed, Prim, but he can't answer you. Oh, yeah. Right. These souls are zombie-like creatures. I forgot. I... uh... I might have an unusual request. What is it, dear? Can I take his soul with me? Just... just for a few days? I I'd love to spend some time with him, even though his brain is mush. That's... unusual indeed. Mm, I, I don't know. I mean, technically, it's not forbidden for the lost souls to go ashore if they're invited. It's just that nobody's ever invited one. You know what? Do it. Spend some quality time with your friend and then bring him back. I don't want the others to get jealous. Will you do that? Yes, sure. Okay. How do I... Oh, just hold out your hand. The gesture attracts him somehow. He'll just float right into your pocket. Okay. It's good to have you back, Triss. You'll be your old self again in no time. What was that? Oh, nothing. I got the soul now, but how do I get the brush? Bien, ahora el cepillo. Que es lo único que queda. Bueno, y lo de la pluma de Fénix, es verdad. Que para eso es el cepillo. A ver, ¿qué tenemos por aquí? Pretty impressive. Tristan used to do water ballet when he was younger, but he had to quit after the whole group almost drowned because of him. 
It sounds like they're warming up. The River Styx Ballet Ensemble invites you to a night of marriage, mystery, and mischief. Quizás la cabeza reducida. There's no need for unbearably loud, unhinged screaming here. There's no need. I don't think she has a secret worth discovering. I've already discovered all his secrets, I guess. No creo que la partida de cartas. Sorry, Prim, I don't have a deck. The cards dissolve in the water. El libro de ventriloquía eh, puede ser. So nice. I don't no. want to make fun of her. Tampoco. I can't use my new ventriloquism skills on that. ¿Y entonces qué? Hablar con ella. Hi, Bella. Hi, Prim. ¿Crees que podría hablar con otra alma? Do you think I could speak to another soul? Oh, okay. Why not? Who do you want me to call? I'm looking for um. Oh. Um, forget it. I'm really bad with names. Mm, qué raro. Are you sure you can't give me Medi's brush? I've never been more sure of anything, Prim. I need to go now. Goodbye, Prim. Come back soon. It's so nice to actually talk to somebody. Karen, do you mind if we stay here just a little longer? I can't leave without that brush. Sure. Take your time. Riñonera sofisticada. Medi's brush is in there. I need to snatch it somehow. A ver, seguramente cuando le dice si quiere hablar con otra alma, pero claro, tiene que decirle el nombre. Cuando ella se agacha a buscar esa otra alma es cuando le puedes robar el cepillo. Pero claro, si no sabes el nombre de ninguna alma... Hey, you. What's your name? John Smith. Ah. Who would have thought? And what's your name? Maria Gonzalez. And who are you? Emily Davis. Oh, what's your name? Alfred Blaine Charles David Alfred. <laughs> Alvin John Kenneth Lloyd Martin Nero. Von Hinchwick since the Nazi home. Senior. Okay, man. You must have needed a magnifying glass to read your ID. Or maybe a microscope. And who are you? David Brown. What's your name? Jessica Martinez. And what's your name? Christopher Miller. What's your name? Olivia Taylor. What's your name? Daniel Wilson. No sé por qué no le han puesto los nombres originales. Tampoco son nombres tan raros. A ver. Hi, Prim. Do you think I could speak to another soul? Oh, okay. Why not? Who do you want me to call? I'm looking for... Um... Y ahora sí me salen todos los nombres, ¿verdad? Está este que es muy largo. ¿Tarda más en buscarlo o algo así? Alfred Blaine Charles David Earl Frederick Gerald Hubert Irvin John Kenneth Lloyd Martin Nero Von Hintz Fish and Stern Arctic Rom Sr. Oh, I know this one. Don't go away, Prim. A lo mejor tarda un poco. Vale, y ahora. I 
El único que puede volar, bueno, volar, saltar. Get me the brush, okay? Es el ojo. Es lo único que se me ocurre. Ahí está. Tiene algo más. Oh, I hope I'm doing the right thing here. Prim, he doesn't know you either. I'm beginning to think you're playing a trick on me, young lady. Yeah, you got me. <laughs> Prank calls are my passion. Too bad you figured it out. Uh-huh. I need to go now, Bella. Oh, so soon? Yes, I'm late for dinner. Uh, bye. Uh, bye? I think we're done here for now, Karan. Well then. Vale, me ha respondido como si le hubiera hecho una broma varias veces, como si le hubiera hecho buscar a varios a varias almas, pero no, es la primera. What's happening to me? What do you mean? I don't know. I feel uh, lighter, more carefree. I feel happy. Yeah, I, I think that's it. We're approaching Elysium. That's why. Didn't they have that effect on people? <gasps> We're going to Elysium? You've booked the full tour, so I thought I'd show you everything. And it's the only route I know. Oh, will I see my mother? No, I'm sorry. We can't anchor in Elysium's waters, so we'll only pass by the shore. Your mother's soul is spending eternity in the shiny celestial city we can only glimpse from here. Oh, but can she see me from where she is? I don't know. Maybe? But even if she could, we would never know. Ahora que se desbloquea en el mapa el Elíseo. Wow. Okay. That's cool. I know. I've seen the tower so many times, but that view never gets old. Are you ready to go back to the harbor? One more minute, please. Sure. See me. What was your mother's name? Morwen. 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 Yeah. I remember taking her across the river a while ago. She was very nice and funny. How? How did she feel? Was she scared? Was she in pain? She was as calm as the river on a Monday morning. We talked a bit, also about you. And then she made some really inappropriate jokes. <sighs> yep. That's mom. But, all in all, she seemed to be absolutely confident that you would be okay. That you and your father would get along. Okay. I'm ready to go now. Thank you, Karan. No problem, Brim. <clears throat> I'm glad I could help. I hope Karan won't tell on me. It's late. I should head back to Thanatos' house before he gets suspicious. Prim, can I talk to you for a second? Okay. You know, I was just at the harbor and I saw the ferryman. He told me about your encounter. He also said something that started me thinking. Oh, shoot! I knew Karan was a snitch! I know that my birthday present was not quite to your taste. What? I realized that I have something that might please you more. My camera! No, it is mine. Your mother gifted it to me. I have never used it, though. It looks exactly like the one she gave me. 
Indeed. You see, Caron told me about your interest in photography. Since your camera broke when I brought you here, I thought you might like to have this one. I would. Thank you. I will leave you to your new toy now. My duty awaits. May you find some pleasure in... That was... Do I really look like that? Give me that! I'm sorry! I-I-I didn't mean to... Hey! Nice shot! I make a much better photographer than I do a model. I don't know. You're definitely bony enough. Touché! Wait! I have an idea! If... Uh, if you're up for it. I do not know. Will it take long? Maybe. Then I cannot do it. I must not leave the incoming souls unattended. Oh. Okay. Oh, come on, brother. I'll keep an eye on things. And if anything out of the ordinary happens, I'll call you immediately, Dark Lord. Hmm. If you really do call me without delay... Without delay. Then I think we can risk it. Okay, let's go! Me falta esa carta, es verdad, la que está en el árbol. Creo, no sé si es la carta que me da Hank al ganarle. Indeed. You should have seen him as a puppy. That was... actually fun. I never really understood what your mother liked so much about photography. What is the point of capturing a moment that will fade away? Are these frozen moments not just reminders that everything eventually ends? I don't know. When... when she was still alive, I couldn't understand her obsession with it either. To be honest, it freaked me out sometimes. She took her camera with her everywhere. On my first day of school, on day trips, even when we went to the dentist. But after she died, suddenly her pictures were the only way to look at her. Getting them out from time to time was painful, but in kind of a good way. Does that make any sense? I believe it does. I want to show you something. What is this place? It is the world between life and death. When humans die, their souls come here first. Most eventually find their way to the realm of the dead by themselves. But some do not. I am responsible for guiding them before they become trapped here. Why did you bring me here? Did you know your mother almost died when she was young? No. There was an accident. She was hurt very badly. That was how we met. I came here to take her soul to the underworld, but life found its way back to her. Most people who have a near-death experience forget about me after a while, but Morn could not. Nor could I forget about her and the way she had looked at me. Not with fear, not with disgust. There was something else in her eyes, something I had never known. So I decided to break the rules and see her again. But where could we be together? You met here. Yes. How did you know? I can feel it. 
This place, it's full of... her. She was happy here. We both were. When your mother became pregnant, we wanted to be a family. We really did. So, why couldn't you? Do you see these shadows on the wall? Yes, what about them? I have never told anyone this, apart from your mother. I was so focused on Morwen and on you. I was so distracted that for one day, just one day, I simply forgot to guide them. So it was too late for those souls. They became shadows, trapped here for all eternity. When I saw what had happened, what my selfishness had caused, I decided never to let myself get so distracted again. Your mother and I parted ways, for I knew I could never be death and a father at the same time. I'm sorry. It must have been really hard. But now, you are both. You know, there's something I need to tell you. Go ahead, Prim. On my birthday, uh, when you locked me in my room, I... I... Yes? Oh, nothing. Forget it. Are you sure? Yes. Can we go back now? It's, it's really late and I need some sleep. As you wish. Well, look who's woken up from the dead. Good morning, Casket Nail. <sighs> morning! Where's... The Dark Lord of Death. Out reaping souls. Doing his job. Ignoring his sister who could help him. As always. Gosh, you look like you didn't sleep too well. I still have no idea how you guys can sleep here when nobody can tell if it's day or night. We follow our inner clocks, I guess. Did you spend the whole evening with your father? Yeah, I hate to admit it, but it wasn't so bad. It was actually kind of fun. That's good, isn't it? Curious, are you sure we can't tell him about Tristan? Maybe he can help us. Oh, sorry, dear. We have to be realistic. Thanatos may be developing a soft spot for you, but in the end, he'd never give up on his principles. Oh. Speaking of, how are you getting on with your task? I think we're getting there. If you need help, just let me know. Our time's running out. We'll need everything by the end of the day, or it might be too late. <sighs> I know. Bueno, pues nos queda poco ya. Vamos a por la por el Fénix. Creo, ¿no? No queda otra cosa por hacer. A ver, se ha. No, yo pensaba que el Elicio se habría desbloqueado, pero no. A ver, se supone que no es buena idea de darle el cepillo, de dejar escapar a Medusa, pero bueno, creo que no se puede hacer otra cosa. Piedra esta. Let's see what you can find over there. Oh, look at you. You're crawling with lice. I'm gonna shampoo you real good as soon as we get home. No arguments. Hey, no, de piojo. No hay nada en esa en esa roca. Vale, vamos a ver. Mary, I got the brush. You did? Finally. And I see you found my phoenix. Yes, cute little thing. Why is he in a cage? Oh, I just wanted to be sure he didn't disappear again. What are you doing there? They don't like it when it's too bright. 
It's their eyes. They're sensitive. What are you talking about? Give me the brush. I'll show you. Can't you give me the phoenix first? Come on, bucket girl. Don't you want to see my beautiful hair? Okay. Oh, thank you, Prim. They've been asleep for years. My poor misunderstood babies. I don't understand. Oh, you will. All you have to do is... Stand still! Oh, Prim, you idiot. Wait, what did Bella say? What did Bella say? Uh, with eyes closed. What did many say? They don't like bright light? Mm. Sí. La la cámara de foto. Shut forever, Prim. Sooner or later you'll open them and then you'll be mine. Forever. Es el mismo modelo de cámara que tenía su madre. You'd make a great y que se supone que tiene el el flash más potente. Have you ever heard of blinding beauty? Oh, oh, oh. Hush, love. Everything's fine. Maddie, you don't have to do this. Can't we talk this out? Forget it. What my babies want, they get. Oh, it won't take long. You'll be I'm not kissing leaving my bucket. Soon. I might never get back to the surface. No sé qué puedo hacer. Otra vez la cámara. You're a queen. And queens like us aren't easily defeated. I've already blinded the hair snakes. A ver, ¿qué tenemos por aquí? It's okay. Everything is okay. It's Athena. If I remember correctly, she's the goddess of wisdom and warfare. Don't let it get you down. You're a queen, and queens like us aren't easily no defeated. Need for unbearably loud, unhinged screaming here. No sé qué hacer. Cortarle los, cortarle el cabello. Won't take long. What us? What us? Kissing again soon. A ver. Ahora. Nope. No. Oh, mama's gonna take care of her babies now. El alma no creo que haga nada, ¿no? I won't fool around with Tristan's soul. I've done that enough already. Oh, it won't take long. You'll be hissing again soon. El libro. I can't use my new ventriloquism skills on that. No. Um, my little friend says no. No, tampoco. Oh, don't worry. The mean girl won't hurt you anymore. Es que lo único que se puede es Medi o el suelo. El suelo, ¿para qué? It won't take long. You'll be hissing again soon. There's no need for un... Oh, mom is going to take the care of your babies now. No sé qué hacer. It's okay. Everything is okay. Don't let it get you down. You're a queen, and queens like us. Hablar con ella. Defeated. You don't have to do this. Can't we talk this out? Forget it. What my babies want, they no, get. No quiere hablar. It won't take long. You'll be hissing again soon. No sé, no creo que haya que irse, ¿no? And queens like us aren't easily defeated. No sé qué hacer. Pero algo que ver. Worry, the mean girl won't hurt you. La piedra que está aquí arriba. ¿Le tirará la piedra a la cabeza? 
not again. The poor thing is already infected with lice. Don't let it get you down. It's too far You're away for me to reach it. And queens like us aren't easily going so soon. The party's just getting started. No me deja escapar. Pero hasta la piedra sí puedo ir. La cámara no tiene nada que ver. There's no need for nada. I think the name's It's okay. Everything is okay. That ain't gonna cut it. It's too far away for me to read. Girl won't hurt you anymore. Going so soon. The party. A partir de aquí no me dejas seguir. La piedra tiene que ser. Tiene que ser algo con la piedra, seguro. Porque yo creo que si la mueve, se le cae en la cabeza. Don't let it get you down. You're a queen, and queens like us aren't easily defeated. That doesn't need to. Oh, don't I worry. Won't fool around. The mean girl won't hurt you anymore. Sé hacer. I don't want to do that. Oh, mom is gonna take care of her babies now. You're good. Pull the cork out. And queens like us aren't easily defeated. I can't use my new. It's okay. Everything is okay. The poor. Pero la araña podría empujarlo. Pero no. Not again. The poor thing is already infected with lice. No quiere. Hush, love. Everything's fine. Que no se me ocurre qué hacer. It's okay. Everything is okay. No. no. What a weird. Oh, don't worry. The mean girl It's won't the camera hurt Thanatos you anymore. Gave me. He got it from mom years ago. Just like my old camera, it has an incredibly strong flash. It's okay. Everything is okay. Don't let it get you down. You're a queen, and queens like us aren't easily defeated. Oh, mom is gonna take care of her babies now. Okay, Regina, you uh, have to help us now. I believe in you. In el suelo. It's okay. Uh -huh. Secador, enchufe, enchufe con riachuelo. No. Tenemos un botón aquí. Medias elásticas. ¿Qué más? Ranura para monedas. Máquina de chicles. You're a queen, and queens like us aren't easily defeated. Oh, it won't take long. You'll be his. Don't, Don't touch them, little friend. They're my dangerous. Darlings, you wicked thing. Si tuviera una toalla. Worry. Ah, ahí está el enchufe. Girl won't hurt you anymore. Una menos. Oh, 
Otra vez la... You can't la cámara. A picture is worth a thousand words. Don't you think? <laughs> Don't let it get you down. You're a queen. And queens like us aren't easily defeated. Well, friend, can you open that cage? Oh, shoot! I need to free it. But I have to get rid of Medi and her hissing strands first. Vale, creo que la segunda va a ser ahora va a ser con la piedra. Ay, habrá que usar las medias. ¿Dónde están las medias? Ah, no las tiene. ¿Por qué? Normalmente le trae objetos. Bueno, espera, espera. Vamos a ver si... Si ahora... Haciendo esto funciona. No. Queens like us aren't easily defeated. Pues las medias no son para eso. Yo pensaba que eran para para llegar hasta la piedra, pero no. Tengo los piojos. Maddie won't let my friend put lice on her hair snakes, but maybe. Cepillo, ah, ponerle los piojos en los cepillos. Ahí están los piojos a los cepillos. You can't rise and shine, you furry worms. Falta una. You can't keep your eye. I thought we could be friends, Muddy, but we just don't click. Y sigo pensando que tiene que ver con la piedra que está arriba. A ver, aquí hay un botón. Suelta agua. ¿Para qué? Daría una moneda. Ranura para moneda. Para sacar un chicle. Ah, mira, las monedas, no las había visto, están ahí. Shoot, I need to free it. But I have to get rid of Medi and her hissing strands first. Ahí están las monedas. No las había visto. Wow, I'm glad it didn't hit me. 
interest in? One's got chewing gum in his hair and couldn't get it out? I had to cut it off. For a week, he looked like a plucked chicken. <laughs> el agua. Creo que hay que darle primero al agua y luego al chicle. Y así se le quedará pegado al pelo. little creature as a sacrifice. It shall forever be turned to stone in your honor. Or should I transform the girl first? Wise goddess, I'm listening. Share your wisdom. El libro. Athena, what do you want? El libro de ventriloquia. Maddie, wait! She seems so caught up in her conversation with Athena's portrait that she hasn't noticed me at all. Let's hope this works. Um, priestess. Huh? It is I. Athena? None other. I am here to... Ligarte o disculparme, disculparme. Vamos a probar por una versión... Por el lado bueno, digamos. Apologize to you. You. What? But you. I know, child. And I'm sorry. I bestowed upon you a far heavier burden than anyone should bear. I know that now. Yes, you did. But I did so much. You had every right to be angry, but maybe it's not too late. Maybe you can still make up for the wrong that you did. But how? Well, you could start by leaving the girl and her little friend alone. <laughs> They're innocent, and you know it. I know. I'll, I'll have to think about it. Do it, Medi. I can't believe that worked! Hey! Regina! Medi is gone! Oh no! What has she done to you? There's nothing left of you but... Uh, a round rock! So this is it. This is how our story ends. Regina! You're not a stone! I thought I'd lost you. Are you okay? There was this girl. She seemed nice, but then her hair turned into... I don't know. They attacked me, and now she's gone. Would you be so kind as to explain what you were doing down there? I...
La verdad es que quería rescatar al Fénix recién nacido, estaba en peligro. To be honest, I wanted to save a baby Phoenix I hatched. It was in danger. The creature that lives in this well, she is evil. <laughs> Now I know that too. And she escaped. Yes. This is troubling. I will take care of it. Do you have any idea of the peril you put yourself in? I'm sorry, but what was I supposed to do? The little bird was in danger. And now it's lost for good. What's that sound? What? How did you get in my pocket, little birdie? That sound means it likes you. Can I keep it? Another pet? Please? Well... You have my permission, but do not set the house on fire. I promise I'll take good care of it. Thank you. And thank you for saving us. Promise never to go near that well again. <laughs> oh, you can count on that. I, um, I didn't want to make you angry. I was not angry. I was worried. Really? I, I need to go back to my studies now. Oh, and I have just been informed the fates have finally opened the new terrace at their tavern. Feel free to have a look if you like. They say it's a time-bending experience. Okay, I guess I will. <laughs> a phoenix? Why a phoenix? That was weird. There's no time to think about that now. Time to pluck a phoenix feather. Oh no, it's only a chick. It's got fluff and fuzz and all, but no real feathers. <clears throat> What do I do now? I need an adult phoenix. Bien, me queda. ¿Cómo hago para que la cría de fénix crezca? Bien, nos ha dicho que en la casa de las moiras han inaugurado la terraza esa que tenían. A medio construir. Hey, the fates opened their new attraction, Timeline Terrace. Hmm, I wonder what the name means. Terraza del tiempo. Bueno, tengo aquí está la cría de Fénix. Que la vamos a hacer crecer con la terraza del tiempo, ya verás. Timeline Terrace. I wonder what that means. What was that? Just great. <laughs> I am officially a dinosaur. But wait, I have granny powers now. I get a discount at the public swimming pool. I can sit at my window and watch my neighbors all day without being judged. <laughs> and best of all, <laughs> I can complain about everything for no particular reason. <sighs> my back. Um, what was that? Oh, my back stopped hurting. Thank Hades. Wait, I'm starting to talk like them. Okay, that was definitely among the top five weirdest things that happened to me today. And that's saying something. Vale, si usó el polluelo o la cría de Fénix con la terraza del tiempo, ¿por qué no? Seguro que sí. Dice que no. O yo pensaba que sí. Vale, y si entro primero... Cría de aracnóculo y un chupete. Aquí tengo todos mis objetos. 
Aquí está el fénix adulto. The Phoenix. <coughs> It ain't too. Let's see if I can. <coughs> yes. Bien, tengo la pluma. Feather. Time to set the Phoenix free again. Thanks, buddy. Take care. Don't catch fire again anytime soon. Look at you, Retina. <laughs> You're old too. Okay, that was definitely among the top five weirdest things that happened to me today. And that's saying something. Y tengo la pluma. Y... Ya estaría todo, ¿no? Ahora debería buscar a Keres. No sé si seguirá en la casa de Thanatos. All the ingredients we need to bring Tristan back to life. That's great. Do you have his soul? Check. His broken life thread? Got it. What about the phoenix feather? It took me a while, but here it is. I have no idea how you manage that. Very impressive. Have you brought the key to my lab? Here it is. Really? How did you manage that? You'll see. Let's go. We need to hurry. 